Good evening, everybody. Hey, man. Welcome. Welcome back, Garrett. Welcome. Welcome. I believe I can hear your music. Ah, yes. A... Routing would still be on from earlier. Allow me like, to... Why, why is... why I'm in Limsa trying to go back to get out of my monster hunting mod because I forgot. And I'm like, why is the music so freaking intense? Yeah, Limsa's getting down tonight. It's like, it's like, I get that this is a bunch of, you know, thirsty mofos dancing here, but let's calm down. Get down. Actually, yeah. there hasn't been as many uh, thirsty dance-offs happening in Limsa. I feel like everyone's like, like they got like horny hangovers from LunarCon. <laughs> oh, huh. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I always go to Ulda. I see the Pope, run past the Pope, say hi, Pope. I mean, I just, I just saw a picture of freaking, uh, I saw a picture in our art channel. I was like, okay, that's enough. That's enough thirst for me oh, for one I, day. Oh, we have, we have thirsty art in the art channel? It's, 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 it's a lot. It's, you know, not technically NSFW, but, you know, I would maybe not show it on stream. Oh, sure. Yeah. Yishtola hanging out. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. This lovely lingerie. Yeah. Oh, your, that's not, you know, how lovely. You're looking for a gift for the lingerie uh, uh, enthusiast in your life. Join our Discord. <laughs> <laughs> Join our Discord. Oh, shit, man. That, uh... A ring endorsement. <laughs> that went in a direction I wasn't expecting. Hey, everybody. Welcome, welcome. Here's our faces. Welcome, everybody. Oh... Uh... Happy to have you all here. Hope you uh, joined us for the podcast early. We did a live recording. Oh of that. my god, that? dude! I had so much fun. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm so, I'm so excited that we're doing it. Yeah. Like, like I'm, you know, Miss Itn. It's it was a major chapter of my life, but uh, I like the new <laughs> show. Uh, someone was it, asking earlier, just as the stream started up, what the footage of Final Fantasy I was showing was earlier. That was the animations preview for Endwalker. That was all around, what was that, November of last year? It was everywhere, but it was showing off the new ability animations that were coming in Endwalker. That ah. was that video, if you want to go check it out, it's on the main Final Fantasy page. And mm. uh, I do not know what the picture is of tonight. Uh, some people were worried that I was uh, chicken coming out of a galaxy with somehow a spoiler. I have no idea. You know, I Googled the name of the raid and I picked the first picture that shows. So we move fast. We move fast yeah, around these parts. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Um, if if you see something from us and you think we spoiled ourselves, chances are we didn't stop to think about it long enough yep. for it to register as a nope. spoiler. Yeah, like I, during the podcast, we were talking uh, jobs because one of the one of the questions that came in to the podcast this week was, "Hey, are you ever going to do a wall of jobs?" So we kicked off our, our our mailbag segment with that question, and so you started showing footage of the I think the End Walker job like it was like job abilities yeah trailer, I believe. yeah all the uh, graphics and it's so a few folks were like oh god are you guys spoiling yourself i'm like i don't consider seeing job like attack animations a spoiler like if i've grouped with max level people i've seen this yep it's okay well, and if you go pvp actually a lot of those jobs come in advance like paladin is doing all the crazy sword stuff they do mm. later on which is really cool which gotcha. Really cool. Yeah. So, I definitely appreciate everybody keeping, you know, trying yeah, yeah. to keep a spoiler keep free. Keep it but real. I, 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 I will go to some lengths. I won't. I, I, I'm not gonna like live in a with my head in the proverbial sand. I'm, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna exist on the internet. If I see a little something here and there, why can't I invite you into a party? Oh, because I already have. Oh, allow me. I have invited you to a party. Oh, I've got. I've Long got a you Hamlet Puller's hat. <clears throat> Where are you, by the way? Uh, I am an I'm in Ralgar's Reach. We'll we'll be taking the quest tonight. Gotcha, Thank gotcha. You, yeah. Or the hat. I, I I see you 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 uh you were like you know what Garrett asked me for uh, not only oh. coordinates but what what uh my I, I it was that the hotkeys I did earlier for the stream. I'm gonna have to think about things because you know my hotkeys are oh. um, hotkey for streaming. And actually, oh, okay. I, I do use these buttons regularly enough so let me go ahead and desync those and i will come up with new hotkeys for the stream the podcast cool. stream cool daycar thanks for the super sticker it's going all right hope you're doing well daycar a good day it has been a good day it's a good day to die in a raid what you doing bailey how you doing bud thank you to pillow keeper for joining the membership much appreciated yeah hell yeah welcome to the gearbox pillow keeper enjoy your emojis enjoy your members only chat in our discord 
David Bear, thanks for the super chat. Hi, love your videos. How much longer till Shadowbringers? <laughs> before the end of August. 100% it'll be before the end of August. I just don't want to give you guys a date if we have to move it around, if someone gets sick. You know, I, I'd feel bad if we had, like, official dates that we could ruin. But yes. 100% it'll be before the end of August and probably a lot sooner than that. Yes. I'm now thinking that, you know, if we got sick, I think people would understand. So yeah, but you know, we'll, we'll, maybe, maybe we'll do a proper teaser yeah. in a week or so. Yeah. Like, yeah. Um, in, in reality, the the uh, the practical answer is when we're done with everything else in Stormblood, we're here. Yes. We're going to do all of the raids, all of the four lords. And we've been promising a community Eureka night forever. So we're going to do that. And yep. we've been promising that we will at least dip our toe into uh, what's the thing we're doing next week? Eureka? That's the thing no. we're doing next week. What's the thing that everyone says is funny and I, I'm pretty sure I won't find funny? Oh, uh, Manderville. Hildebrand. <laughs> Manderville, yes. We're going to dip our toe into Manderville, which I'm just going to keep telling myself I'm going to hate it so that when it when it happens and it's not as bad as I think, it's somewhat enjoyable. Yeah, who knows? We'll see. Where we'll the see. hell are you? I'm up on that uh, the jump puzzle we were shown that one time. There, Ow. So when we jumped up here originally, I didn't have the lookout log for Stormblood, so I went and picked that up <laughs> a while ago. And so when I was showing up here, I was like, oh, there it is. And plus um, uh, legacy controls, I think it's called, makes it really easy to do sideways jumps. So I was like, you know what? I've got five extra minutes. Let's see if I can do it. I got on my second try and I was like, yeah. How does it make sideways jumps any easier? You already just, you just jump straight sideways if you have a strafe button. I don't use strafe buttons. I, I always oh, detach oh. them. So legacy. I, I do. Yeah. Yeah. No, I don't, you I do like use. the Q and E's, I believe. Yeah, because I never unbound them in all of my years of playing WoW, so having them unbound in an MMO is just, it feels wrong. Totally. Oh, Sin is gifting me a dope-ass sword. Yeah, quite a few oh, more super chats. Bank. I'm going to start start digging Sin, into thank them. thank you. Oh, YT Valia, thank you for the generous super chat. Kyle, I tried out Dancer for the first time a few days ago, and I love it! Playing as a male Elizin, I look fabulous. Fabulous! I know you have your reservations, but I had to chime in my endorsement for it. It's weird seeing Valgant get down. It's weird <clears> seeing <throat> him just dance. Dance for battle. Ugh. But it does look fabulous. I think maybe, maybe I should try out some other outfits. Honestly, this week, I kind of really like Archer. I, I realize that it's full of instant cats. And since you are moving while instant casting... It's kind of badass running at full speed and firing arrows at the same time. And I kind of dig it. And we'll see. I'm, st I'm still on a trip to try every single class, every single range class before I make my call for Shadowbringers. I want to have touched them all. I tried out Summoner this week. Um, all the guide videos said that it was boring easy and too much ruin. But we'll see. Yeah, I'm still making my way. Uh, oh my god, that's a, that's a really big super chat. Let's get that in just a moment. Um, thank you to Kiyoshi and Caddy for signing up to be members. Kiyoshi celebrating three months saying love the content. Keep up the good work. Thanks for sticking with us for as long as I believe is possible. That's true. Three months I think yeah. is the longest. You can be a member right now. So thanks, yeah. Kiyoshi. Caddy, welcome to the Gearbox. Enjoy your perks. Fane, thanks for the super chat. So we know about Lay Anchor, but y'all know the difference between Larbird and Starbird? question mark Lobber. is 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 that gonna be um i don't know larboard what is larboard star and the starboard and port right starboard and port, port and starboard yeah. is 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 right and left but i always forget which side is which yeah i don't, I don't know i haven't spent any time on a boat my my growing up the years, front is, what is larboard i don't know people are smiling about it so larboard there's there's smiles related assume... to larboarding I'm, I'm assuming it's going to be a mechanic tonight, Kyle. I bet ah. it references a mechanic. Okay. I'm like the trying map, to read chat while also doing the jump puddles is not going well. Okay. I see you. I see you going on back there. You're making your way. You look good. So I made, I already made it up to the top almost once, and then I fell all the way back down, and I choked right here. All right. This is further than last time. You got it. Hell yeah. Unleash. Hell Man, yeah. Nice job. Nice Kite job. Man. Hell yeah. Well done. Where are you? Are you all the, all the I'm, at, the I'm at the end? Yeah, There's I'd, so many orange names. I can't see where I'm walking. I had to walk. I had to walk out here to all get right. the, the. All right. 
Uh, all right. I'm just going to, you know, everyone can stare at me. They've been staring at you long enough. Um, <laughs> all right. You can just look up at my ass. There you go. It's, it's rare that your character ever has to look up to me, just like in real life. That's true. Um, yeah, Kyle's really... So everyone says I'm tall, and then there's Kyle, who's pff, ridiculous. Um, let's see. Where do we go? Where do we leave off? We, we left off with Fane. Sarcastic Geek, thank you for being a member for two months. Said, I saw your wall of trials for Stormblood. Have you done one for the dungeons in Stormblood? Yes. No. no, no, we have one more dungeon to go. Um, yeah, which and, we, there's so well, I guess there's not that many. No, we can do we can do them all in one video. I think there's seven total when we're all done. So it won't be. It won't be our biggest wall of dungeons, which was nine. I believe seven. I'm also being whispered that you should turn your head on because people are trying to give you stuff. Oh, are they? Including a party oh. invite. Oh, wow. Wait, no, I've accepted your party. I accepted. <gasps> I pressed party. Maybe I couldn't do it because I was trading. Hey, do you want to see Do you want to see a dog that just got a bath? <laughs> yes, let, let, I want to see a dog that just the got a bath. The one that hates baths. Oh, so, the, so Wicket hates baths. I'm just going to grab my camera. All right. And y'all can just see the poor that's so sad wet, poor wick. wet pupper yeah wick it has been the dog that has jumped out of the bathtub and ran through the entire house mm -hmm. soaking wet before yep yep she hates baths it's okay she sweetie it's okay hates. it's okay oh all right let's get the wire back behind the monitor and there we go oh, <laughs> oh we love you she's just staring at me like so do you sad. see what she do did to me do you see Daddy told me to give you a bath. Do you see? Oh, all the Zeldas. I'll make a wicked emoji eventually, Wick. I promise. You have hair oh, all in your eye. Or lint from the towel, I guess. Oh, oh, oh Zelda. Hold on. Kyle, I'm sorry, so but are, do you now need we're to be? just... Get now it's just... Zelda. I'm sure. Now it's... Yep. She heard her emojis. <clears throat> yep. She heard She heard the emoji. She saw the emoji wall, and she wanted to say hi. <laughs> oh, you smell. You ran out in the rain today. You smell like it. Today. Yeah, yeah. I, no, no, not too. Just this is, it was not. It was not a hint. It this, was not a hint. This was the stinkier. Of the two. Yes, Wicket was in a bad way. She you gotta pick your battles. Them. Yeah. Yes, you do. You gotta pick your battles. Battles. Okay. I see. Okay. I see. Something there. Next to Something chat. there. There's something there. Gustavo, celebrate in two months. Take your time getting the Shadowbringers. I still need some more time to finish so I don't get spoiled <laughs> watching you. I like how it starts. Very like, well. Listen. It's your journey. Yeah. You, you take it, but also as slow as you want. Also, just so you know, yeah. I'm not there yet, so I'd really prefer actually if you took a little bit longer. Exactly. I, I see you, Gustavo. I see you. And then Sorcarto with a, uh, a truly uh, massive super chat. Um, oh, I guess it's converted. It's not up at the top anymore. Anyway, nonetheless, we thank you for your super chat, Sorcarto. Says since you've all you're already at the reach, find a yellow quest named Ant Juice. <laughs> What? What? Ant juice? Ant juice. It takes a couple minutes to do and it gives a very cool head glam. Most people overlook it because it's a yellow quest. Oh, huh. ant juice. Huh. Okay. I'll look into that. Let me add that to my list of questerinos. Thangs. Yeah. John celebrating three months. Three months. Got to do Endwalker raids. I'm behind on those. <laughs> very well. <laughs> Thanks for being a member for three months, John. Al's, Al, Al's screen name is what I want to say. Al SN. Uh, thank you for becoming a member. Welcome to the Gearbox. Awesome. Lots of members. Enjoy though. your Appreciate emojis. It. Oh, look at all those adorable little ant emojis. I haven't seen those before. I like those. Cactus piss quest item best, qu best item. <laughs> oh, and then we got a bunch of no go fasters in the chat. This is the week, Kyle. This is the week everyone got impatient with us. <laughs> well, you know, you've been back for, has it been a month already? You went on vacation. No, no, no. two weeks. Yeah. And, oh, no, while you were out of town, uh, 4.3 came out, which... 4.3 came out? What are you talking about? Our video on 4.3. Oh, our video. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. I was like, what are you And then it was two about? weeks 4. before 3. that or a week before that that we did 4.3. So it's been a little bit since we MSQ'd. There's just so much to do, and it's all really high-quality content. Like, even Monday, we did the Monster Hunter event, which is like an event. Like, a, you could say it's throwaway, <laughs> but it was really good. It was really solid. So, so um, listen, 
everybody, we're we're adults here, right? We're ready for truth. Mm -hmm. Can we handle truth tonight? Oh. Can we handle hard truths? All right. This this what are you like doing? A, a, I want to be I want to be real with you all. Uh, okay. So, if if you're like, "Oh my god, just get the Shadowbringers. Just go." If you're like feeling a little impatient, you like our stuff and you're really excited for us to go to the Shadowbringers. You only have potentially yourselves and this community to blame because the entire reason <laughs> the entire reason we're taking our time and we want to make sure that we get all the raids done and and four lords done before we step into Shadowbringers is because so many so many of you have said once you start it you're not going to be able to put it down yeah and so I have internalized that as once I start Shadowbringers I ain't never coming back to this Stormblood yeah. stuff <laughs> It would be a shame. Like, <laughs> honestly, I, I, and I'll reveal this here. There was actually, because of the powers of editing, there was three different endings possible in this last week's video. Because I could have twisted it many ways, you know, doing the editing on it. Garrett could have won. I could have won. We could have broken even on the final ranking of the Castrum Fulminus. But I lined up those two videos. I lined up Fulminus and steps of faith, final steps of faith next to each other. And was like, no way in hell can I let Full Menace fall behind this. The graphical quality has advanced far too much. Final steps of faith is so gray. And even with Nidhogg shooting giant space layers, lasers. I, I th you know, I, I've been thinking about it since, and I think I, if I had to grind it, I think I'd rather do Nidhogg. It is just it, it is it is a classic ass raid fight. Yeah. It, it really is. It's yeah. got some great mechanics. Great mechanics. Surviving Scholar, thank you for the super chat. I don't disagree, Garrett, but the Mass Effect 2 comparison was apt. Which one? Mm -hmm. What are we talking about? The Omega the Omega 4 relay, kinda we gotta get everything done before we go through. Oh would gotcha. be my guess. I'm assuming. I'm, I'm, I don't, did we mention, did we make a Mass Effect 2? A while ago that, we was, did. Yeah, we talked about oh. getting everything done before we go through. L listen, our streams are like usually three to four hours uh, and we say a lot and I don't always remember everything we said. But. We just finished a two hour podcast and I don't true. remember everything we said. That's true. Our brains may be a tiny bit mush tonight, but uh, more so like it would be really sad to see Shadowbringers content and then try to go back and do like storm blood videos and like half the time in your own head you're like ah, I've seen cooler than this like even like Alexander is so tame looking and when people say the PS3 died for this it's like it's a cutoff point it's not what you're watching like the Shinryu Omega fight isn't the most mind-blowing thing ever but it showcases where things switched and same thing with the cup of tea for Heaven's Ward when the voice acting switched and there's these moments where they're working on the game and it's like they finish the main game and then all the patch content, they're like, look how much we've learned in a year and a half since then. Look, look, look what we can do now. And stuff like the, the Evil East camera angles. <clears throat> to go back and like watch a cutscene for Omega after you've seen Evil East stuff, you're like, well, I mean, I've seen some impressive stuff. And I can only assume that Camera angles, animations, graphics, all this is going to keep building on something. It's crazy. By the way, how, yeah. do I, how do I get rid of these numbers? All my stuff has numbers on it, and I must have pressed the button. I don't know. Uh, oh, uh, uh, yeah. Why do I have a bunch of numbers? You know what? We're not. That's fine. I don't need to figure that out anyway. Um, we can aspiring go Scholar said last week you compared playing here was like saying, I'll get to Mass Effect 2 eventually. Hmm. Hey, I listen, that's true. Yeah. Like, I, I replayed oh, Mass we Effect 1 the, last year. Yeah, the moon and stuff. Because of the, uh, yeah, I, I replayed Mass Effect 1 last year, and I knew that I like anything I wanted to do in Mass Effect 1, I just had to do it then, because I wasn't going to go back to it once I started 2. So, yeah, 2, that's uh, such a good game. Uh, let's see here. Kiyoshi, thank you for the super chat. I am here for the sincere views and opinions from you, too. Keep them coming. <laughs> awesome. I'm glad. I'm glad. Um, yeah, because, I mean, I'm I'm full of hot takes. By the way, Kyle, we're so close to each other. I didn't know that I could crane my char my player character could crane his neck so far down right now because I'm clicked on you. Oh like yeah, you're in a seating. Look, look at yeah. I'm like breaking my neck trying to look at you. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's a cool feature. I like how the NPCs look at you as you go by too. But it does it does cause stealth issues if you're like looking at someone's mm. glam or something like that because you'll walk up to them and you're like, mm. Mm. yeah. Well, that's why you don't click on them. 
Display hot bar numbers. Okay, cool. Yeah. Did that get rid of it? Why is there still zero hanging out by my... Oh, that's because my current power level is zero. Perfect. Thank you for the option. Appreciate it. Thank you, John, for a super chat. Said, had a new baby this week. I just wanted to send some positive dad energy. Good luck Hell in yeah. Omega. Love the streams and videos. Keep, Please keep them coming. John, congratulations. Congratulations. We should be sending you, we be sending you a super chat as a baby gift. Well, congratulations. That's awesome. Yeah. Hope you're all that's, doing that's... well. Fantastic. I sent out a, uh, a baby shower gift today to a friend I have had since preschool. Nice. Getting old. Wait, wait, wait. You wait, already, wait, have, wait. You already have a Your doctor but... friend? Your doctor friend? Yeah, Steve. Baby? Oh, congrats to Steve. They're about to have a baby. Hey, They're about to, to Steve. Have, about to have a kid. Yeah. going to be a dad. First, I had to make peace with the fact that he's going to be a doctor. So I was like, <laughs> I've gotten drunk with you. This is kind of weird. Um, yeah, and now I have happens. to make peace with the fact that he's, he's going to be a dad. And I'm like, I've gotten drunk with you. This is going to be kind of weird. Yeah, no one's shocked. The guy that used to play video games all the time in high school ended up doing video game shows. No one's thinking like, Kyle, man, that no. weirdo. But he I ended haven't... up, where's he now? <laughs> I haven't heard. I, I've never had anyone who knew me from school come across our content and go, I can't believe you did, You ended wow. up doing this. So no one's surprised. No one. I think they're more surprised that it's actually a little successful. <laughs> I digress. Uh, Silver, thank you for the super chat. Says Shadowbringer is considered to be the best JRPG in the last decade. Yeah, I don't know why you wouldn't be able to stop. Hey, listen, I say it's 50 50. People tell me it's Shadowbringers. Other people tell me it's Endwalker. Yeah, I think that's great. I think that's and awesome. every once in a while, I hear I hear Heaven's Ward, which, you know, is my current opinion. Hearing any good news about the ending of any story is amazing. Yes. Endings are hard. Yeah. That's why I still preach the good word of Breaking Bad, even though I know Kyle will never watch it. Never going to happen. Probably not. <laughs> Eagle Garaz, thank you for the super chat. I'm here as a full-time emotional vampire, so enjoy both of your reactions of each and every side quest before you get on the Shadowbringers road trip. Thanks, Eagle. Yeah, I appreciate you. Sabaz Dornez, thank you for the extremely generous super chat. Won't be able to watch your live streams for a while starting next week, but I will continue to cheer you guys on. Enjoy your journey. All right. Hey, Sabaz says stall. It's not exactly what Sabaz said, <laughs> but I'm going to interpret it that way. I so, really appreciate the support. Well, <laughs> thank I, you very much. VOD playlist is below. They're, of course, on the main page, youtube.com slash amovetv. Uh, someday they'll let us change the name of the YouTube channel, but, you know, every channel is dealing with that. So, but. Mm. It's all there. I hope you can get caught up and join us later. Appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Star Johnson, thank you for the super chat. Also a, a generous one. Mm -hmm. Shadowbringer story is so much that you won't want to put it down, but you really will need to in order to process. I'm excited to see how you guys react. My best friend just finished 5.0 and was blown away. That's awesome. Nice. We, you know, I'm going to... I'm going to let folks in a little bit on conversations we've had outside of the stream, which is you and I have had very frank conversations about the reality that we may need to do a MSQ video for each and every patch. Uh, well, well, because the, the original MSQ is long, right? So we also, we were, we were talking that we might need to do a lot more MSQ videos than we usually do, starting right. with Shadowbringers, just because of the vibe we're getting about the density of narrative. Right, we're we're thinking that like maybe more of a book club, like we were doing a like these were more like mini documentaries for Stormblood, but something a little more yeah. book club adjacent might be right for the Shadowbringers content. Yeah, so that's we're we're prepared to make a lot more videos if we need, which also means it may take us longer than usual to get through the MSQ, but I'm I'm okay with all yeah. of that. More standalone videos is sounds fun. Take, I like taking the time to kind of digest the story. Um, it, it It's made me start looking ahead. I'm like, what do we do when we're current and the next expansion comes out? Because then we'd be experiencing at the same time as everybody else and no one else knows how good it is. Yeah. Like, do you think we'll take our time or do you think we'll just like ravenously burn through it? I have no idea. I don't know if you jump in or if it would be like, a tactical delay let other people play first and then enjoy because you know we wouldn't want to stream a day of necessarily because then you'd have spoiler issues for the audience so you'd want to maybe give the audience time to play through it first so they can enjoy what you're doing as well but that would also be like just as uh, just as a straight like video gaming fan 
it'd be really frustrating for a game that you want to play to come out and be like, I have to wait three weeks because of content creation issues. Meanwhile, we're going to put out a bunch of, you know, non, I don't know what they're going to call the next expansion, you know, super new adventures, uh, things. <laughs> Cross that bridge when we get there. Who knows? <laughs> Sin just whispered me, said whenever 6.2 comes out, I'm going to ravenously burn through it and be sad for four months. There we go. Oh, that's good. Uh, Soul Away, thanks for the super chat. Cheers to you guys. Love your content. Kyle, watch Breaking Bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Soul Away. <laughs> All right. We're going to need to set some ridiculous. It'll be a goal. Yeah, like, we'll do something. That should be a, a goal over on the Patreon. Like, if we hit $1,000, like, you you have to watch Breaking Bad. I will Bad. do my book report on Breaking Bad. We had $1,000. We got to we gotta do Breaking Bad. I mean, Pillow I... Keeper, thanks for the super chat, says, I hope we have an overhyped Shadowbringers. I don't think so. Uh, I it's it's I would I would say it's honestly not that much different from Heaven's Ward. Mm. Um so plus I I think I'm diluting it a little bit with like people probably think it's just really good cuz like a lot of people think uh, Stormblood is just okay or or not the best, you sure. know, depending on who you are. So, I have my own personal ways to kind of dilute it. Um it, I I mean I like Sh Stormblood, so I have a feeling I'm going to like Shadowbringers. Cilantro Gaming. Uh that's all I would taste if I played your game. So I would love to watch you guys play Monster Hunter World. Don't choose the hardest weapon, weapon next time. Uh, rolling, crying, laughing emoji. Oh, did I, was the shield and sword the most complicated did, weapon? You did mention that in the podcast today. Okay, yeah, maybe so, I did. Yeah, yeah if you all, you all want to hear Kyle's Monster Hunter uh, anecdote, you should listen to the Grinding Gear podcast episode two. It just posted. Lincoln. Just posted. What? Lincoln, I posted Lincoln. Say, oh, you link. Okay. Oh, did you do the, the the one I set up? Yes, you yeah, did. Yeah, yeah, I did the nice oh, one. Oh, yeah. I love you, man. Go for it. Love you. I spent I spent a lot of time on that. <laughs> Not really. Gab uh, Gab Gano, thanks for the super chat. Shadowbringers is just okay. Hey, well, uh, who who was a pillow keeper? See, Gab Gano's doing doing the Lord's See, work, bringing down our expectations. I'm, I'm fully embracing the hype because everyone everyone smiles knowingly, seeming like it's my jam. So I'm doing nothing mm. to reduce my hype. I'm fully. I am fully invested and I could go if this could be full blown like Wings of Liberty, like it's everything I wanted, or it could go Anthem. Either way, you'll be hearing about it. So this is your fault. <laughs> not not uh, not uh, Gab Gano there. They're, they're, they're doing fine, but yeah, everybody else. But Gab Gano's fault. I, it's just a fun experience, man. It's just I, I like every everyone's got a little different take on their hype. So I'm just I'm just enjoying the communal experience of it all. Uh, D Bellboy, thanks for Super Chat. I promise you'll need vids for all Shadowbringers content. Cool. Sounds good. I'm down. Lyman Tree, uh, Super Chat. Next expansion is called Star Runner or Start Start Runner. Yoshi told me. Is that a joke? Oh. <laughs> well, Yoshi told them personally, so we don't know. We don't know. <laughs> Toast Batman, thanks for the super chat. Jeff H, Toast thanks Batman. for the super chat. Says, still haven't taken this away from me. What does every Moogle need in the morning? <laughs> what does every Moogle need in the morning? Uh, I, I saw this uh, screen by here. Yeah, a Kupo uh, coffee. Uh, <laughs> Thank have you, Have fun Jeff. in Alpha Scape. Thank thanks, you, Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> Chris, thanks for the super chat. Set good goals for Breaking Bad. 1,000 for season one, 2,000 for season two, et cetera. Make it worth your time, There we Kyle. go. Yeah. Yeah, as it gets more intense or sad or whatever the hell happens in that show. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it kind of starts as a dark comedy. Uh, I, I would say it's a dark com comedy throughout. It is funny at times. Have you ever if seen, you have that sense of humor. Have you ever seen Traffic? No. Okay, that's a phenomenally unfun movie. So. Okay. Did you have fun with Breaking Bad? Was fun had? Yes. Okay. I really like the character of Jesse Pinkman. He makes me laugh a lot. Okay. Uh, but he also has a big heart, so he's a character I could also root for, and and you know, so I had a good mix of laughing, uh, but also like having a character that I wanted to see make it out of this p spiral of despair. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, you know, the goals will be made. I like the suggestion. <laughs> I like vernacular ham. Thanks for the super chat. Oh God, the anthem reference. I feel your pain. I was, we I was were dope. we were. We were poised to start an Anthem podcast. Yeah. Poised. I, I had art made in everything. Uh -huh. Yeah. Live service games, man. What can go wrong? <laughs> Bullet dodge. 
Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what could go wrong? He looks at the burning pyre known as Blizzard Entertainment. Oh, Start Leaf. Runner. Start Runner and Walker. Start Runner. Right, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, I yeah, get yeah, it yeah, now. Yeah. And oh, the, wow, I'm dumb. I feel dumb. Oh, well, we're not in End Walker yet. Yeah, we don't know the jokes. Leith is uh, celebrating three months of memberships. Re up and again. Thanks so much, Leith, for the continued support. Says one thing that doesn't get enough specific emphasis is that come Shadowbringers, the game starts using its music and the storytelling better than most musicals do. Mm, mm. Interesting. I don't always like it. I, I tend to not like it when there's lyrics, I'm going to be honest. I think um, like, I, the way I take this is not so much that there's lyrics, but could be what they're hinting at. More so, have you, you well, Avatar Last Airbender is a great example of this. There could be a generic track for every single fight, but the music's actually unique per fight. Mm. So that's the way son, I'm taking what, it. Son, what art are you talking about? The, the Thirsty Years Tola art we talked about a while ago? Wait, is someone desperately trying to find it? No, I don't. I just says, can we see the art? That'd be cool. I don't know what art you're talking about. Yeah, they might be in the past. No, we're not going to show. Uh, we're not no, I mean, show it, was, it was minutes ago. So, Oh, it was probably the Anthem art. No, I think I've, I think I have since purged that, that oh, file. Oh, yeah, yeah. So I'm like, uh, never doing anything with this. Hey, you can join our Discord if you're looking for Thirsty or Stolar. Or <laughs> I don't think that's what they're looking for. Now that this makes way more sense. I'm stupid. Sorry. Uh, Kiyoshi, thanks for the super chat. I'm wrapping up the latest Shadowbringers patch content, and I will tell you this. Every time I finished a milestone, I went to go look at React videos and feel justified in my thoughts. I'll watch yours too. Thanks, Kiyoshi. That's exciting to hear. Yeah. Megan Perry. Super chatted. Do you know why everyone wants an astrologian in their party? Who doesn't want a friend with benefix? Yeah. Same one your spells. I get burp. it. Burp. I get That's it. That's a very visual joke. You gotta you gotta read it to get because if mm -hmm. I if someone just said that to me, I would just assume they just said benefits. I think there's spells across all final so you might be deep enough in Final Fantasy to know it. Like um mm. like the, their purge and their fireball, like fire three and all that kind of thing, you know. You, you <laughs> might be might be deep enough. Yeah. Nano super chatted anthem. I learned my lesson about hype with spore. Oh I I truly mean this isn't me like trying to like be like a cool nerd or whatever. I was never hyped about spore. I thought that game looked bad from the beginning. The first level's so good when you're like playing cat and mouse and running around. Spore looked like those. What were those lame ant toys as a kid where you like you stuck the legs on? That was That's a game. That's what spore uh, looked like to me. Pants in my pants or something like that. No, they were just like the, the hollow cooties. That's cooties. it. Yes, they were like cooties. It looked like cooties to me, man. I was like, that game looks not great. I thought it was cute. It was. You know, it was supposed to be expansive. It just sucked. It was a different game per level. Like they, they had no through mm. line. I beat it once, but it's, it wasn't a great memory. Mm. I'm trying not to stand on people, but I'm also trying to be be close to Kyle. Here, I'll stand behind you. There we go. We can do the. Uh, I'm blocking. I'm blocking. Uh, uh, Hunting Hawk's wonderful dance back here, but you know, you get the. You get the 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 Val tuna sandwich. There we go. There we go. We're gonna just center up on you. Uh, let's see. Jelani, thanks for the super chat. We're only hyping Endwalker up because we know you guys will dig it. I look forward to watching you guys play it. Enjoy Shadowbringers in the meantime. It was great. Or Stormblood in the meantime? SB is Stormblood. Yes, there's an H in there. That's HB. Yeah, and it's a lowercase h. So I was lowercase h. I'm learning things. Maestro, re up in membership for two months. Thanks so much, Maestro. Can't wait for both of you to finish Alpha Escape. It sold me on Final Fantasy XIV endgame content. So many masterfully designed fights, and the story goes hard. I'm I'm ready for that. I. I think Omega's been kind of one note so far. Well, I, I keep saying Omega. It's I mean it's called Omega, yeah, right? Yeah, like colloquially it's the Omega referred rate. to, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's just been like I don't know. Go to go to the thing, do a test. One of our friends gets attacked, like or two. I Lost guess started off with Pigs and Wedge. They have been good balance battles. Yeah, I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Dave Koth, super chatted. I really enjoyed Yida's Stormblood character development. She really got a new lease on life. Oh, you. <laughs> You, I should know better than to think than to think Dacoth was doing a sincere message there. I, sh I should know better. I should know better. Desade super chatted. There's going to be a piano concert next year for Final Fantasy songs. Heaven War, uh, Heaven's Word for 14, in celebration of the 35th anniversary. Is this like a touring thing? Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. The, the uh, they've done like orchestra shows for it that have come through town quite a few times um here that like i remember seeing but i wasn't into final fantasy but now i might actually go if it comes back through jeff h said uh, uh since you were ho hopeful for anthem have you guys seen 
exoprimal stuff. It's not really the same, but it is exosuits and co-ops. No, it, we have isn't that the uh, Wait, I can hear back. you. Hello? I can I can see you. I can hear you. Okay. All right. I think we're coming back in. There's just been a hiccup. Hi. Hello. Hello. How's Let's everybody see. doing? Let's see. Let's see. Are we back? You'll Are probably have to fix. You may need to fix cameras. We got kicked. Hey, I see an A from Luke. When I see an A from Luke, I know we're good. Okay, I gotta properly log out here. Okay. I'll, I'll, let me. Uh, Delightful. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go. I'll go full Kyle. Full Kyle for a moment. Full Kyle. Yep. Never go full Kyle. They're expanding my neighborhood, so might uh, might be this time of day. Oh, I have seen Exo Primal, and you're right; it is the one with the doors. Uh, but no, I have not played it. I don't think it's out yet. I don't think it's oh. actually live. It did they use Anthem assets? Because it sure as shit looks like they're using it's Anthem assets. Very, very similar, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. I, I listen. I uh, I'll I'll need it to come out and other people to tell me it's good uh, before I get hyped for anything with suits again. I don't think they're going for the flight thing. Oh, but the flight was the only good thing about Anthem. <laughs> I know, I know, but I feel like that's what held them back in the end, and that's why they, you know, crashed and burned. As they, were... I don't, they also used a multiplayer engine to make that game, which they should have because you know, uh, let's not... <laughs> I'm, I'm still hurt. I'm still hurt. Let's not talk about Anthem. Yeah, Sooty Thunder, thanks for the super chat. B five point oh two days ago, and you guys are in for a treat. Thank you for warning. <laughs> Thank you for warning us that it's good, City. Nice. Vernacular Hand, thanks for the generous super chat. Starting with Omega, I realized all the raid story is super important. Hate to call it mandatory, but it's all important. Then I went back and did Coils of Bahamut and realized it starts there. So do it all. Yeah. Uh, so far, I feel like Coils of Bahamut is still the most mandatory. I, I, Alexander does not feel mandatory to me at all. And so far, Omega doesn't either, but we'll see tonight. We'll see tonight. I look forward to our conversation about Omega because I'm pretty I'm pretty mixed right now on Omega. Yeah, uh, Cause of Bahamut was them ending the what felt like the 1.0 storyline, but it yeah. also helped establish why the A Realm Reborn world is as messed up as it is, and that was really important. They really need to go and put that on some sort of duty finder kind of thing, like and let people play. Yeah, that. it's it's also just good and interesting and really cool. Yeah. And grandpa. And grandpa. 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 Kids. Still one of my favorite jokes we've ever done. Absolutely. That was such a good idea. Uh, Guardy, thanks for the super chat. It's a full. Oh, sorry. If a full Garrett is a skull, a ska wrestling move, what's a Valtuna sandwich? <laughs> uh, what is a full Honest Garrett? Bell. Is that a uh, wait? Ska wrestling. That was a joke during the podcast. It was oh. a joke during the podcast. Okay. We were talking about the. Uh, I still got to hear the pork. My my oh, my pork pie hat. Oh, okay. Because I love ska. Okay. Oh. Um, so, uh, yeah, we they were uh, or, or someone you said full go full Garrett or something during podcast, and people were like, "What's full Garrett?" And I was like, "I don't know." It involves a lot of ska and cocktails and cars ah, or something. Okay. Uh, the Val Tuna sandwich, that's what we do to bosses, cause, especially since you've gone samurai, because I'm tanking them and yeah. they're facing me, and then you're behind I them like stabbing it. them to death. I like it. That's what's going on there. Kiyoshi, thanks for the super chat. Mobs are getting smarter, hitting bandwidth versus HP. Right, right. <laughs> Construction got me. I like it. Also, can I just say, I love that like our viewers didn't dip during that little outage. Thanks thanks for hanging. Thanks oh, for chilling. Pretty, pretty cool. Appreciate y'all chilling. Sh uh, shall we uh, Shall we ship? Yeah, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna BRB. We've Ship been off. here. We've been talking for a little bit, so I will make my way over. Make and... my way. Oh shit! I can't. I forgot I couldn't fly. <laughs> and we will get underway. Oh, I just like I just yeah I didn't make that a a, a pretty dismount. You're gonna BRB, he said. Yeah, just do a quick little BRB. I mean, if we're gonna really BRB, I kind of want to make a cocktail. Sure. Why don't Why don't I? So you take your break, okay. and then come back, and then I'll we'll we'll do the thing we haven't done in a while, where I bring the camera with okay, me. Okay, sounds good. Well, we'll be keep, here. Keep we'll be while I make we'll a be drink. chilling with Jesse. We'll get ready cool. for Jesse. Cool. And I'll be right so back. So if anyone, if anyone needs uh, anyone watching needs anything, you can, uh, you know, go go get a drink. 
Uh, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, once Kyle's back, I'll bring you all with me out to the kitchen. We'll make a little raid cocktail. And we'll go from there. Making our way through space. Teleporting, fa oh, there's, there's, the syllables don't work out there. Doesn't work out there, Deep Bell Boy, I'm sorry. I'm a syllable, I'm a syllable Nazi when it comes to parody songs. Cocktail time, yep, cocktail time. Sounds of everyone's mounts falling. <laughs> Uh, did you see the Tactics Ogre remake trailer? I saw it getting shared. I haven't watched it yet. It was a long day today. I had to do uh, I had to do some video editing for clients this morning, and then what the hell? Oh, Katie's in the background with a steamer and scared the shit out of me. Hi, honey. There's a light on it, and I'm like, what is this robot monster that's coming to to kill me? Um, yeah, and then we did the podcast. The podcast went long. We also started late. Kyle was having, uh, we, Kyle was setting up for streaming, and it was our first time streaming it on YouTube. So we had a learning, learning thing. Uh, learn, what, 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 what's the word I'm looking for? Learning curve? Katie, what cocktail should I make? I don't know what cocktail I want. I know I just want a drink. Oh, chat wants to know where the turtles are. They said no turtles today? <laughs> she is so mad I, I was like no we can't keep any of these turtles <laughs> oh you only want to keep half of them well there was 13 so where do you where do you draw the <laughs> silver thanks for I'm the back. super chat can't, yeah, silver's just super chat it says can't stick around we'll watch catch the vid later thanks silver yeah, enjoy thanks the VOD and thanks for stopping by while you could All no right. I did not get my Rathalos mount um, yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to think of what to make. I do have mule stuff. Okay. Make my, I make my mule a little different, but then I'd have to, I'd have to crush ice. I mean, I don't have to crush ice, but a mule without crushed ice is not really, mm -hmm. it's not satisfying. Okay. I'm trying to, th what do I, what do I really want? Are you going Kyle? through like what a recipe book or something? Life? Going, no, Are I'm, Googling? I'm just thinking in my head. Oh. I have so many options is the problem. I see. It's, it's like there's just so many things well, that I, I got could a, make. I got a cider here. I got a. Oh, you got a cider. Look uh, at you. A London um, Dry. You know what? We've been talking. Uh, you know, it came up on Angry Chicken. We talked about Negronis during okay. the pre-show and how a lot of people hate them. And I love them. I'm going to make a Negroni. Cool. All right. Uh, let me do. Let me do this. I'm going to yeah. swap Discord onto my phone. Perfect. And you can. It'll, it's going to make the video explode like usual. Yep. I got you here. We're ready to rock. Jared shall return, everybody. Here he goes. We're live. Via remote broadcast. Can you hear us? <laughs> he, he's checking if he can hear us. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, I can hear you. Yeah. Uh, oh. Hello. Right. You can hear me now. I can hear you. I think it was just a bug because I could okay. see you, but I couldn't hear you. <laughs> yes, the floor is wet. Hi. <laughs> Jeff H. Thank you for the super chat. So I missed the end of the Rathalos stream. Why didn't? What did, what? Okay. What did you think about your introduction to the previous expansion, Mount Farming, rather than current expansion, which requires more brain power? So what'd you think of farming, Garrett? Uh, hey, kitty. So sorry, hold on. I, I need to move the kitty and the drill. We've been doing some home improvement and this is where I make drinks. So, uh, sorry. So what about the farming? what do you Next think of the farming in an old expansion rather than new farming, whatever it is? What is new farming? I, I guess my my confusion is what is new farming um but yeah i don't know kyle then left so uh i i don't understand versus new farming what is new farming i we don't know we don't know uh, like uh well i guess uh what did you think of the farming system in final fantasy then compared to something like world of warcraft um, well, I mean, it's specific, right? Because it's just, it's just to that trial. Um, there's so many different forms of farming. 
in in both, right? Because I mean, I remember trying. I never got it, but like the time lost proto Drake in World of Warcraft, that was a world spawn, which is different from like trying to grind a drop in a in a dungeon. Yeah. Um. So I would say my my gut feeling with Final Fantasy is uh, uh, because of the fact that with, with something like that, you go straight to the boss, right? So you just get straight to the fight and you do it and you see if you got the drop or not. So. You, you know if you, you, you got what you wanted a lot faster, which I like, and there is the, the kind of bad luck protection in that you're picking up the scales and eventually you can just buy the freaking mount, yeah. which I love. Um, I'm going to get some bottles. Yeah, no, I'll, t- I'll, just take, I'll just take you with me. Yeah, yeah bring, um, it, bring us with. Our, look at our, our lovely collection. Fine Good collection. stuff. Nice light. Well done. Uh, Zelda's being crazy. Yep. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, you guys get a show. Y'all are just joining. This is the pre-show, <laughs> the dog pre-show. To yeah, the sorry. Alpha Scape event. We we did we did we spent so much time doing Q and A Q&A with chat that now I want a pre-raid cocktail. Yeah. Well, not a pre- well. I will be drinking it during the raid, so I'll become a worse and worse tank as the night goes on. Now you're just reducing your damage taken. Ah, I like that. Yeah. You're just you're uh, dulling the pain. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome so. everybody. Welcome everybody who's filing in. We have not set sail yet for Alpha Stream. We're about to. We are about to. If you have any questions for us as we get going here, welcome, welcome. I will be playing on controller this evening. If anyone is also new to our stream, Sometimes we do this. I'll make a drink before we go run a raid. Yes. So hi, that's what I'm doing. I've got my big ice cube. I'm gonna go put this glass in the freezer. He's got his very large ice cube. You gotta do it, man. It's mm. all about the molds. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And where do you think where the Omega story is going? I have no idea. Uh, it's been cute that like Omega's been searching online for bosses. And... <laughs> We're going to be deemed the most powerful being in all reality. So that's be. where it's going. We're, we're going to win the Cell games. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and I like I like those episodes where they teleport everyone to Hulk Mania or whatever it's called, and they all have at each other. I think it's a cute idea. And getting to experience old Final Fantasy bosses, while I don't have nostalgia for them, like, the train fight was amazing. So there's been some really cool ideas in there. Oh, I forgot about the train fight. Yeah. I do like the train fight. Uh, some great bosses, for sure. The mechanic, like, the Nero bosses are probably my least favorite because I don't like vehicles and I don't like having bonus buttons for a single fight. But that's pretty nitpicky. I really like them. Overall, they've been really good bosses. The paint idea was really cute. I just like using my current kit when I go into a boss battle. How do we like Just, Alpha? Alpha's cute. He's I like that I like the tongue in cheek nature of the um display. Like they're aware that they are using a mascot in game. And Jesse joking about how she's gonna like make a mold of him and sell plushies is really cute. And also the fact that, you know, they actually did that. Yeah. Will you make a wall of raids at some point? It's weird because there's eight man raids, there's trials, and then there's alliance raids. So I do, I feel like trials like like the warring triad should go on the wall of trials perhaps, and eight man raids should go in raids. But it, I don't think you can compare the eight man raids and an alliance raid. It doesn't feel right. Plus, there's all the wings, and you have to divide them up by wings, maybe. So maybe you just do a boss tier list for the whole, for the whole expansion, and add it to them. Yeah, and, and we have to get to multiple expansions to have enough alliance raids in order to kind of pull off that. And then do the wall bosses. I like that idea. But we really enjoy doing the wall stuff. The wall content is very, very fun. 
Come with me to my freezer. Uh, we got some other super chats from Rysophos. Hope I'm saying that correctly. Yay! I got COVID the day before my birthday. Now I won't be able to eat dinner with my twin sister who I haven't seen in a yeah, the stream helps. I'm glad we can help out tonight. Hope you're doing all right. Oh, that is so Hope unfortunate. you feel better. And you, I'm sorry you're missing out on your, your dinner there. I have been hearing from so many people that they're getting COVID. And, I mean, I got it not that long ago for the first time. Yeah, that was a month and a half ago now? Yeah. I'm glad I have it when it did, because I was fully recovered by the time it was time to go to the Florida Keys. I would have been really bummed if it impacted that trip. So... And and then D Bellboy, uh, Dry Martini. Wait, three measures of Gordon's, one of vodka, half a measure of Tina Linnet? Shake over ice and then add a thin slice of lemon peel? You're basically describing a Vesper. However, you wouldn't shake a martini unless you're James Bond who orders them like an a hole. Um, but. Uh, yeah, uh, we make a lot of vespers in this house. Kina Lillette does not exist anymore, however. The what? So Kina Lillette is in the Casino Royale novel, which is the description of how to make a vesper martini. Okay. But when that novel was written, Kina Lillette still existed. It no longer exists. Um, Lillette Blanc is considered the closest thing, but it is actually missing a bit of... I think Queen Quinine? I don't think Lilith Blanc has Quinine in it. There is a thing about Lilith Blanc where it is actually not as close to Kino Lilith as a lot of people assume it is. We have a dry wick. Oh, oh, yes. oh yes. Welcome back. Wicked has been blow dried. Wicked has yep. been blow dried. Yep. So, anyway, I, I digress. Um, I do like a Vesper, uh, but uh, I don't. I don't shake my martinis because everything comes out of a bottle. There's no point in shaking them. You're just making them more diluted. I have no... It's like listening to an Omnicrafter try to explain the end game. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh, if everything comes out of a bottle, you, you stir it. Uh, well, what wouldn't come out of a bottle? Citrus. Because it comes out of an orange? <laughs> uh, well, typically a lime or a lemon. There's not... Not a lot of good cocktails, in my opinion, that include orange juice, but... Um, uh, yeah, here, let me swap back to the good mic, and I can okay. pull around yeah. the nerdery. Yeah, tell, tell me all about it. Yeah, let's see. Let's end here. I'll be right back. Howdy, Super. Are we going to play the summer event? Yes. Well, I am. I, I want the shorts. I want the shorts. Uh, as for, you know... Garrett, I don't know. We'll see. But I want the shorts. So I have no idea what the summer event is. It's like a a fair or something. I, I have no idea looking at it from the outside, but it looks lovely. It looks like uh, Lip Limpton Tea wants to look like. My drink? Yeah. Oh, well, cheers, everybody. There's my, my finished Negroni. We did mm. it. Oh, wonderful. Back to one chin, Garrett. Oh, did I have two chins from the from the low angle? I believe it. Maybe it happens, man. Have you ever switched on it. that? I, yeah. Yeah. Hey, man, I, um, I'm in, uh, I'm, I'm in pretty, I'm, in, I'm pretty happy with my, uh, my body at the moment. So what's the, I, I ain't got no complaints. What, what's the excitement about the summer event? I, yeah, we've never done it before. Is, is there like fair games or something? Thank you, fabulous mods, for knocking out the bots for us. That'd be fun. Yeah, we could maybe do like a Wednesday, like short stream for it. I have no idea what it's about. Oh, now that I see the Bellboy's super chat, it was straight up the that is the quote from Casino Royale. Ah, I see. As like one to one the quote, um, uh, specifically um, the movie Casino Royale. Which okay. I recently watched. That movie still kicks ass. I love yeah, it's solid. Casino Royale. It's solid. The good James Bond movie. Uh, sorry, I, I didn't I didn't realize it was a direct quote, and I just went off like a, a cringy cocktail a hole. Just started about, correcting it. No, I liked yeah. it. It was it was just like, No, you don't shake your martini. Listen, if you want to shake your martini, shake your. The best drink is a drink you like drinking. But uh, if you're if you're into kind of cocktail nerdery and just general general tips and tricks. The general rule of thumb is if everything came out of a bottle, you stir it. If there's citrus, you shake it. 
Because citrus is harder to incorporate. Dagoth hit us with this one. Have you seen this yet, Garrett? Or can I ask you the joke? All right, go for it. What band is universally hated in Garlemald? Universally hated in Garlemald. So it's a joke about magic or... Uh, I, I got nothing. Third Eye Blind. Oh, Jesus, that's good. Yeah, that's pretty, that pretty decent. That is good. That's pretty good. I miss Third Eye Blind. I don't, I don't miss a lot of Top 40 Radio Rock from the 90s, but I miss Third Eye Blind. That's a good one. Well, shall we talk? Shall we Let, finally click this blue quest? Let's, let's do it. Let's go. click the quest. Let's fucking go. Oh, oh, God, there's so many people. Oh, I yep. literally can't see Jesse. <laughs> She's glowing. Let's, there she is. Jesse greets you with a mix of enthusiasm and concern. Uh, I believe you were Jesse. Why would she make... Oh, what? Oh, good time, pal. <laughs> there's been another anomaly detected in the on. Assuming previous instances are anything to go by, this energy fluctuation is another of Omega's so-called invitations. If you don't mind waiting a moment or two, then we can discuss things with Master Garland. He should be right here soon. So this is post him leaving uh, Ivalice's quest there. I wish I had Jesse's girl. That's all I can think of right now. Hmm. The chief should be here by now. The chief. I bet yeah, my, my stock doing nice in the pose. company. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, Orzia has stock, huh? Uh is oh no I know, well, at least right? they don't have nfts yeah yeah it is a square enix game yeah uh fiddling with that research data i look fabulous tonight hmm well i suppose i should explain even if the chief might prefer me not to share after your last run with omega master garlon had some research notes smuggled in from the empire from garlemald the notes are part of Midas Nan Garlon's legacy, who was, of course, the chief father and emperor's preeminent engineer. The incident at Bozja Citadel. Do you know of it? My character might know of it. I'll roleplay. I, mean, I, I don't remember it. I've got to just been never heard of it. Okay. All right. She's going to be like, you were there. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let, let's, let's be truthful. I don't remember Jack. Wasn't, isn't that the farming ground? Oh, she's talking about Midas and Dalamud. That would have been pre A Realm Reborn, yeah. Oh. Basra was an Imperial Fortress city. It was there that Midas constructed the Lunar Transmitter device built to communicate with Dalmud. Emperor Solas had ordered Midas to devise a means to destroy primals, and so he sought to harness the power of the Red Moon. The project was a failure. Oh, he, dis he succeeded in controlling Dalmud, all right. But the immense energies emitted from the satellite vaporized not only the transmitter, but the entire town in which it was built. As, and as you can imagine, the job of sifting through the rubble afterwards was no pleasant task. Master Garlon was slated to assume his father's position as head engineer. But this disaster added to his opposition to the Empire's path of conquest. Convinced him to abandon his homeland. Oh shit, this is some big backstory on... Sid. Yeah. Like, I know, like, a lot of this is inferred, but I don't think up until this point you or I have heard it spelled out so plainly. No, no. We know he's got issues, particularly with Nero, but we don't know why. We do know we randomly yeah, well, floated it, it, with him <laughs> through space, though. Well, that's, that's, I mean, that's just sexual tension you could cut with a knife, man. Yeah, they're both so handsome. The Stormblood Chief... presents My Two Dads. The Chief had wanted nothing to do with the lunar transmitter or the data used to create it until now. Who was... Who was it that we found who was like a ghost or like a projection of themselves in, um... Oh, uh, you're talking about the beginning of Coils of Bahamut. Yeah, Coils of Bahamut. And it, it looked like Gaius, but it wasn't Gaius. It was, uh... The armor was Nail? very Garlean. Nail? Nail. Nail. Okay. FF14, Nail. I'm trying to remember there. Nail Dias Darnus? Dias. Is that Wait, it? Wait, was that their middle... Are they that low? Because that would mean they're not very high ranking yeah. if they're a D. Oh, no, they're a Vaughn. They're a Vaughn. They're Vaughn. Okay. Whatever DS Darnus is, I'm not going to hit enter on that so I don't get spoiled on whatever the shit that is. Um, all right. The Chief had uh, wanted nothing to do with the Lunar Transmitter or the data used to create it until now. 
I think he means to put that research to use in your conflict against Omega. In fact, given the time frame, there could be no other explanation. Nice eyeshadow, Jesse. Listen to me, Val, Tuna. The Chief's genius is plagued by a great deal of apprehension. But even so, once he makes a decision, he doesn't do anything by halves. When the time comes, he comes through for us all. You have to believe that. Believe it, Kyle. Sorry I'm late. Was a little too focused on my work and lost all sense of time. Well, he'd be all also, emotionally invested my... now. Sorry, what was that? Wouldn't he be all emotionally invested? You know, BFF, Nero is down, still sick. Oh, yeah, I he's like too. pouring over it. Yeah. Pouring over it. Um, what was I going to say? I was I was going to make a joke that Sid was also like, also, my ears are born burning. You're not in here dropping massive lore bombs about my backstory, are you? That's no excuse, Chief. What have I told you about being punctual to staff meetings? In any case, <laughs> I shared the situation at the yawn with Val and Tuna here. Good. Then you know that Omega is likely to ready to con uh, is likely ready to continue with its tests. Shall we go and knock on the door? But Chief, Biggs and Wedge aren't fit for field work yet, and the Kyrujans and the Kyrujans given Nero strict orders to stay in bed. That's nice. I don't care. And what of Midgard Sormer? Still taking his nap, is he? That's right, I did like it when Midgard showed up and uh That was cool. Yeah. Yeah. That leaves only you, Val, Tuna, and Alpha. Maybe it's time I join the expedition. And what? Charge admission? No, Jesse. I need your talents elsewhere. There's a half-built device in the workshop that I need you to finish putting together. I clicked twice. God damn it. What did it say? We got here. I've drawn up a design and completed the core mechanisms. The final assembly should pose no problem for an engineer of your abilities. A new device? Does this mean you use the... Ahem. Whatever you say, Chief. I'll have it ready and waiting for you. Just be safe in there. Right. It's back to the rift for us. Let's finish these experiments and bring the fight to Omega itself. Big Quay energy. I love, I love whenever Sid's involved because I can always tell when there's new folks in the chat. <laughs> they're like, Zap Brannigan? What the fuck? These choices were made back in a realm reborn. <laughs> these choices were made back in a realm reborn. Ooh, He's a ooh. captain of the ship Enterprise. Oh, oh my, pardon me. And is... so he gets this voice. What is this? Butler's jacket. Cool. Oh, you got a butler jacket. I didn't did get you? one yet. No, no, I'm checking out the dancer here wearing a yellow butler's mm. jacket. That's stylish. Okay, right, I, I see what you're talking about there. All right. <sighs> to the yawn. I wish that I had just his girl. We're still not in a party. Oh, let's do that. Uh, we also got some super chats during that. Sonic Rose, thank you for the super chat. The Moonfire Fair is a seasonal holiday followed by the Rising, which is a unique Final Fantasy XIV event celebrating the rebirth as a realm reborn. That's neat. Accept the goddamn party invite. Where is it? Oh, it's down here. Okay. <laughs> you mother. <laughs> I'm good. We're good. We got it. We got it. Dear God. Uh, I'm trying to get you to party off. God Megan damn. Perry, thank you for the super chat. What do you call a botanist dragoon? <laughs> botanist dragoon <laughs> a florist uh, because the dragoons are always on the floor because they're dead oh yeah. i'm unaware of that joke yeah. oh yeah, okay. yeah that, that's a joke is that uh you know dragoons floor floor uh, inspect a lot okay i want to i want to do a dragoon man that might, might be the top of my list after reaper they always they just look so fucking, i love a stinian man yeah Dragoon is the first job I'm interested in because I'm enjoying my time with Final Fantasy XIV. It is because I have played this game and now I understand what a Dragoon is. And I have quested alongside Asthenian that I want to be one. It is the Death Knight of Final Fantasy XIV for me. Because I only gave a shit about Death Knights because of the lore within the world of Warcraft itself. And that's a really cool thing <laughs> for me. Bruno, thank you for the super chat. 
Nail Diaz Darnis is the name of Bahamut. Oh, is the name Bahamut gave her, with Diaz being a Latin word for God. It's still the same in Portuguese. Okay. Oh, so we were reading the Bahamut name, not the name she had back in Garlemald, which is why we had two different names on the list. Ah, gotcha. Sooty Thunder, did you hear about the Lalfa who escaped from jail? Police are looking for a small medium at large. I think I have actually heard this joke before. Sir Cardo. Which I don't say to, to take the wind out of your sails. I'm more just proud that I've been a part of the Final Fantasy XIV community long enough to have heard that joke. We've done it. Sir Carto, thank you for Super Chat. Jesse is the Tataru of the Garland Ironworks, holding everyone and everything together and managing the internal business besides. I agree. I agree. She does good work. Megan Perry, thank you for Super Chat. What is a Red Mage's favorite drink? Vermouth. Oh, Ver. Oh, yeah, okay, I've played enough Red Mage. Ver comes before a lot of the spells. Ver, so yeah, I get it. I get it. Paul Scott, thank you for Super Chat. Ne Nail Von Darnus was the main antagonist in the 1.0 lead up to Talmud's falling. Bosja disappearing gets mentioned in 1.x. This is this is catching you up on it. Very cool. Very cool. Are they the one in like the they're, they're like the mad scientist gear with like a machine that they're pointing at the sky? I've been sent some random 1.0 cutscenes. Oh, I know interesting. They're a lot more armored and bigger in Coils of Bahamut when you eventually see them. Oh, so that's why it's like a big deal that you run into. I, so yeah. Anyone who played 1.0 and then went and did Coils probably was like, holy shit. I'm trying to understand the Vermouth joke for Red Mage. Because uh, all their spells start with Ver. So it's like Ver Fire, Ver Ice. Oh, so that Vermouth. makes a lot of sense. Yeah, that's, a, that's a joke. That makes sense. I've never known anyone that just like drinking Vermouth. Well, almost, almost, actually. Never mind. My friends do drink just Lilith straight out of the fridge, which is Vermouth. Sorry. Getting... Can you tell I want to talk about cocktails? I turned in my final this week yeah. uh, to a multi... It was a me multimedia class, and we had to do a three-minute video that told a story. And so I got all my cocktail friends together, and we did a, we, I told the story of how we got into cocktails hey, in three minutes. We, we told everyone brains were going to be mush tonight. Honestly, dude, I feel so much better right now than I did when we... When we wrapped the podcast, I went and I sat out back and just, like, let the sun beat on me for a bit, and I was just like... Dude, I am like, I'm like entertainment drained. Mm. And then I had dinner and I was like, I'm so stoked for raid. I just felt yeah. so much better after I ate, man. Sometimes you just got to eat. True. You just, you just got to eat. Got to take care of your bod. Uh, YT Valea. Thank you for the generous super chat. Join the Dragoon Corpse, Garrett. Heart emoji. I will one day. I, this is something I will do. This is one of these. I'll add it to the list and maybe I'll get. I will do a Dragoon one day. Kyle's going to have to take some time off at some point. We're going to have to do some job quest streams. Maybe oh, yeah, Dragoon that's true. That'd be, be a great time. Yeah, you can stream while I'm... Maybe uh, Dragoon will be one yeah, of them. Yeah, well, baby number two. Yeah. Baby number two arrives. Do we, do, we, do, we know? do we know if it's boy or girl? I, Actually, I, I know you know. Are you, have you gone there, public? There are, there are isolated family members that I haven't gotten to tell yet in person. So I, okay. I'm keeping so, it secret just because family needs to know first. Understood. Yeah. Yeah. All we'll, right. We'll get there. Talking to Sid. Are you ready, Valentuna? I'm uh, ready to put an end to this. Uh, I'm going to say maybe I should do this alone. Sure, yeah, be a badass. Or well, I'm worried about Sid and all of our friends. They've all been attacked during the course of this. My Sid said, aye, there's no room for hesitation. We press on, come what may. Is this the only impression that we can both do? Possibly. How, how's your meat wad? <laughs> not, not great. Not great. Oh, you, you can't do that. Do what now? You can't do that? No? Okay. My Sid says, come now. We're in this together. And if you'll just indulge me a little longer, I do have something of a plan. Leela. What about you, Alpha? All set to go? I bet. Yep. Quick, quick, quick. Three ways. That's the spirit. Let's dive right in shall we and we're off here we go i assume there's oh we didn't actually get kicked so there's no trial this time uh oh shite yeah what's going on here and now there's splashing noises down. like we jumped into the pit yeah it sounds like we're underwater yeah oh now we're god 
my character looks so cool. I miss having emo hair. Mm hmm. You can't have it now. You look like that one guy on TikTok that does the emo TikToks. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Can't do it now. He's like our age, and he has a wig that he puts on. It's very funny. Sid says, We're missing some death worlds. Omega's experiments must be nearing an end. Here it comes. It's I, I can't stand that they have a base, but they fly around like that. It, it drives me crazy. It's right up there with the snake ladies. Do you have your verbal voice ready? Oh, right. I, I come. It's been a while. <laughs> it has been a while. It's been a while. Where was I? Kyle Harris Hang on. Doing his robot for There we us. go. All right, here we are. Welcome, welcome. Your arrival has been highly anticipated. And I will confirm your earlier suppositions. My experiments have indeed reached the final stage of the 89 test subjects I trialed. Four side group combatants emerged victorious. Of those four, further conflict determined the strongest among them. This surviving specimen shall be your opponent. We've come to the last round of testing then. And should we win this battle? Are we... Wait, are we to finally face you in combat? Affirmative. Such an outcome would allow me to peruse my... pursue my objective to its conclusion. I would continue analyzing the qualities which allow you to prevail despite your frailty. And in the great set of qualities into my own arsenal. I will be pleased if my experiment yields the relevant data, but engaging you directly is still the most effective and reliable testing method. <laughs> Omitting intermediary steps, Evaluation of combat, potential team, superfluous, proceeding immediately with a final experiment. Stop. <laughs> I'll just gonna nod and walk. Your task is complete. Your presence among these test subjects is no longer required. What do you mean by that? Don't take my little friend away. I will guide your progress personally from this point onwards. Alpha's role in transferring authority is now obsolete. Even so, Alpha is a valued companion, and if he wishes to continue on with us, I've no intention of leaving him behind. Look at those sad eyes. Companion? Companions are those who provide mutual benefit. The instant Alpha's authority became redundant, he lost his sole qualification to be regarded as such. Mm. Furthermore, the primary function of Alpha's existence was to spur you into my domain. He would be more accurately described as fate. That's rude. It's okay, Alpha. I don't think you're bait. The test subject Alpha can neither confirm nor deny my statement. He possesses no memories prior to his encounters with you. He was the first entity I created here in this realm. My first and only attempt to recreate a being who shared your mundane parameters. I based his incarnation upon a most ordinary life form, one which had somehow tested an enemy whose strength rivaled my own. By observing the evil creature in the heat of battle, I sought to understand the source of his contradiction. Or was it a red chocobo? Hmm. Oh. 
Oh, that doesn't seem good. But I guess he can make anything he wants, so. I repeated the experiment once, twice, a thousand times, yet the results never deviated from estimated projections. <laughs> the test was an object failure, and thus I resolved to adapt my methodology. There's an anime protagonist flying above us. I would focus instead <laughs> upon stimulating powerful opponents and summon mortals of nature natural origin here to combat them. For Alpha, I decided a new purpose. I erased his memory, implanted a compulsion to return to me, and ejected him into your world. Weak beings exhibit a tendency to form groups. I surmise his instinctual behavior would aid Alpha in bringing me the pet subjects I required, a function he has performed with adequate competence. Tell me something, Omega. This ability of yours to generate matter was not originally intended for creating other life forms, was it? Your query bears little relevance to the topic at hand. Affirmative. I was equipped with matter generation capabilities for the purpose of ultimate, unlimited self improvement and armament expansion. Fabricating life forms was not the intended function. But the practice is not otherwise prohibited or problematic. I disagree with you there. As an engineer, I would advise against using such technology for purposes outside its design. From the very start, you've been making the same mistake. Even the powerful subjects of your test words were made crippled and incomplete. It is conviction which drove this vil these villains to terrible greatness. The same limitless conviction which allowed weakling heroes to overcome them. This really ties in with his whole, uh, yeah. like, okay. turning against his own, <laughs> <laughs> turning against his own homeland. Do you not understand? Then we will never lose your creations, no matter how much stronger they should be according to your soulless calculations. Come, Tuna, Val, let's be on our way. You do, Alpha. Oh, Alpha is so sad. Oh, come on. You cannot, you cannot make me look at that. That is too sad. There we go. You cannot tell me that the Warrior oh, of Light is not a himbo. You really can't. Which is like so endlessly positive. Except for that one time we wanted to kill Asahi. That was warranted. And we technically. Oh, it was didn't. totally warranted. And technically, we, technically, we got kill stole. Yeah. Technically. Never level up like that. Oh, hello, friends. <laughs> Rhyme, Silly Beans. I admire your dedication. Sid, what's up, buddy? We're just gonna talk again. Kronk to your himbo. I yes, yes, yes. I have our base camp up and running. You can dive into the final test world whenever you wish. As for the world's inhabitant, Omega has generously provided us with a basic profile. Your opponent's name is Chaos. The first heroes defeated this evil in a conflict that took place so long ago, I'm having trouble separating myth from history. Unless, of course, this is an entity from another reality, as were the denizens of the Sigma Scape, in which case it may be pointless to even attempt to confirm the details. The chaos? The chaos? What is certain, however, is that this chaos stands triumphant over a roster of truly monstrous test subjects. It promises to be a grueling battle, but one which will open the gate to the fighting Omega itself. Everyone's just yelling chaos. Yeah, 
But you gotta kill chaos, Garrett. Put the limp biscuit on, okay. Alpha, you and I will need to provide support for Tuna and Val. Will you be my assistant? Oh, wiggle the butt, but he's still sad. Yeah, yeah, that's half-hearted, poor guy. Oh, did I, did I miss a thing? Oh, oh, what is happening? Sorry, I, I undocked something from my chat. Now I'm confused. How do oh. I redock it? What do you, what do you dock? Oh, I hit X. I got oh. it. I got it. I clicked too many times. You're bothered by what Omega said earlier. You think you're responsible for dragging us into this mess? Trust me when I say this is not your fault for were the others. Uh, well, sorry. We were the others who, who, who awakened Omega and we're the ones who need to deal with the consequences to which alpha says well we're just gonna stare we're at poor to, sad alpha yeah, here we're trying to come up with a way to cheer him up now i'm trying to figure out what zap would sound like if he was trying to be like hey you got little guy it's okay by the way do you still have that card you used to boil water in the kettle it's been brought to my attention that I'm a spoiled blue blood who can't even refill us a pot without constant reminders. If you could take charge of that, then it would be most helpful. Well, I like the Is that Sid's music? Yeah. It's like really somber. It is convenient without Midgard Summer here to translate as tripping or inconvenient. It gives this whole place more of an Epcot vibe than it already had. <laughs> Jesus. Spaceship Earth is now open again. Please, Q. Uh, still, the best medicine for his worries is for you to win this next contest. Let's show him we're on top of things, eh? Said confirmed Canadian. It's good music. Yeah. I've never really picked up on it before if it's played other times. Yeah, people are saying it's the Ironworks theme, so we may have heard it in... Uh, it's super Star Trek-y. Yeah, it is very Star Trek-y, I agree. Yeah, like in a good way. Because I wonder what oh. Nero would say about this Chaos fellow. Ancient technology is his specialty after all, but by default, he's learning a thing or two about mythology and history of bygone era. I wish the super chats were time stamped. Where do we, where the hell do we live off? Oh, uh, join the Dragoon Corpse was the last one, right? Yes, yes. So we've got quite a few super chats to thank before we jump in here. Jonathan, thanks for the super chat. If you've leveled Dragoon, Astinian has custom dialogue in Heaven's Ward. I replayed Heaven's Ward for that reason. That's I think a cool I idea. That. I think it's come up before. Yeah. But that's awesome. Fane super chatted. I want to see you two talk about Dark Knight Quest so bad. Yeah, that's the, for me, that's the very tip top of my list. Like, do it, Kyle. I just want to talk to you about the Dark Knight Quest. However, I guess they just keep going, right? Like, yeah, we'd have to be done with the game in order to do them all. So we could essentially, pick a yeah. Point or... oh, they're, they're so good, though, yeah. man. They're so good. Um, Fidgel, thanks for the super chat. Said Nail and Eula's story is so friggin' weird due to localization, giving her male pronouns. They had to fix this by saying OG Nail's sister took up his name. Is that where that all came from? Oh, okay. All right, that explains it i guess i thought i was just like well that seems like a needlessly complicated story beat to throw in but okay but then again i haven't looked it up because i'm not sure if they tie into future things so when yeah, we're all caught up maybe we can look back at the wikis and stuff and deep solve deep that. lore yeah yeah dude going through this without being able to like openly read wikis it, it's tough yeah it's real tough i always just didn't wow because i'm like oh, i don't care uh super sideswiper thanks for the super chat of course, Omega is important. Alpha's in it. There we go. <laughs> All right. Essential. I can't argue with that, even though I know Kyle doesn't think Alpha's that cute. Well, I, I, no, Alpha just has so much like Ronald McDonald mascot energy. I'm cautious of Alpha. It's not that I don't like Alpha. I'm just worried about being advertised to. Kyle? Yeah? You create content Based, about yeah. retail products. I'm aware. I'm aware. Yeah. Yeah, I just, no, I'm, I'm aware. I watch kids' cartoons. Okay. Yeah, no. There, yeah. There, there, there's, there's a difference. Have, like, you wa have you watched Owl House yet? I don't know what Owl House is. Oh, wait, no, that's the watch, thing on Disney+, Plus, House. right? You were telling yes. me about it? Okay. Yes, watch it. All right. Watch, watch, watch the that. The difference will always be for me. There's, there's like, there's He-Man tier, which is like made to sell toys, and the toys were for the show. There's 
like Star Wars tier where they didn't know it'd be success and then they sold toys. And then there's like Paw Patrol teal tier, which is way too much. Like there's way, there's toothpaste and diapers and, and foods and snacks and gummies. And like, it's just, it's too much. We had that for Ninja Turtles. I know. I'm aware. I don't think we had Ninja Turtle diapers because that was a little too old, but we yeah. definitely had Ninja Turtle toothpaste. I had Ninja Turtle toothpaste. So I'm just cautious of Alpha because it's such a, a slogan. You know, it, it's such a mascot. Okay. okay. Dino, thanks for the super chat. You must kill chaos. And I'm then excited. Winkle says, super chatted, I have to kill chaos. It's a hunger. <laughs> what is going on with chaos? What is, I don't You get didn't it. know about Chaos? You've never seen um, uh, Stranger in Paradise trailers and stuff? No. Okay. A, a year ago, I think it was, maybe even longer now, a video game came out where a guy kept saying he had to kill Chaos, and it was like a comedy action. It was absolutely ridiculous. It, it's like Devil May Cry kind of tongue-in-cheek. Mm, I need to play that new one. Devil May Cry, that is. Ryoko, thanks for the uh, Jammer Super Chat. Uh, seeing you mixing drinks there, I have a game recommendation for you to check out. It's called VA11 Hall A. It's a game about a bartender named Jill and mixing drinks and changing lives in a cyberpunk style setting. But it's what? Valhalla. Oh. Yeah, like it's, it's like cyberpunk Valhalla. I'm, I'm, let me just look at this real fast. Oh, it's like retro. Oh, I like this. Wait, was it? Look at this. Is that true, Mike? Was it not meant to be funny? Stranger in Paradise was not meant to be funny. Oh, looks like you can get it on the Switch. Oh, it was a limited run games. Okay. Okay. Because if I mean that, that's the fun of like you know many comedies is that something's played straight that's ridiculous. But if they actually didn't mean for it to be funny, that's a whole nother level. Because it's hilarious. <laughs> All right, so we need to enter AlphaScape version 1.0. Yep. If you ran with us this past Monday, please give other players a chance. Please do. We would really appreciate it. Um, we have, uh, uh, a sadly, sadly, we have been extremely lucky to have the level of, uh, of success in growing our viewership here that we have. Um, there are over 900 people currently watching, and I imagine quite a few of you waiting to get in. So if you have run with us recently, please give other players a chance to get please in do. here when we post this. So this is I'm happening in the this. Discord there. Daz there is posting the links. You can find the party password channel. And that's where we're using the party finder. And also while you're here, like the stream. Helps out a lot. Also subscribe to the channel for more content. It like does. That. Yeah, we're sitting at a little over 200 likes, but over 900 people watching. So, you know, just like the stream. And if you're not already subscribed, we did just recently hit the milestone of 20,000 subscribers. Yeah. We would love to keep climbing. Thank you so much. And if you aren't subscribed, please do so. Especially if, you know, you're liking the the stuff we're doing. And if you're not liking the stuff we're doing, um, I mean, thanks for watching. Yeah. It's a little, <laughs> little strange. Thanks for hate watching, I guess. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, I've, I've been loving controller. Well, we'll, I think at some point, I want more, I want more under my belt first so I can explain it better. But at some point we'll do like a keyboard versus controller video or something like that. Mm. Cause I want to tell you about it. It's a lot of fun and it works really well with Samurai. That's, that's cool. All right, I am about to post the code. Again, if you ran with us on Monday or last week, give, give some other folks a chance, please. There it is. It has been posted. Hell to there we go. the yeah. There it is. We also recommend that if you are uh, wanting to run this, form groups and run simultaneously. Yes, with us. please do. If you did not get an invite, absolutely make some fellow groups. Join yes, your you would friends. Actually, yes, I, I implore you. You were doing us a favor because there's so many people that want to run. And there's only so many slots so uh fame thanks for the super chat says 950 plus people watching and only 200 likes come on chat thinking emoji oh. i th thank you for paying to promote our like button yeah i really appreciate that complain. and kevin welcome to the gearbox thanks for becoming a member really appreciate it all right i need to i need to hide these other quests because my 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 screen is a bit of a mess yeah, at good the idea moment. good idea Exactly. Tortoise, tortoise and time has just been hanging out there the whole time. Yeah, we just got to turn it in, but we ran out of time. We'll get that. I know. Exactly. Exactly, tortoises. Derek Shepard. Only 100 mind. minutes and we're in the raid. Exactly. Nailing it. Part of this is a hangout. Yeah, you know? no, no, no. I'm not making fun. Like, I'm proud. I'm proud. We get to the content. Don't you worry. 
We won't leave you guys hanging. We got to schedule. We will do what we came here to do. Yeah. Wait, wait, why can't I find this? What are you looking for? Oh, oh. I, I found it. Let me make sure minute eye level is on. Yes, hit us with that. Because we don't want to burn it. We just want, just want to burn through it too quick. There it is. I'm going to start recording for clip purposes. Commencing. Cal, did you see my nice new uh, teal garment? No, I'll take a look at you here. I didn't realize you were all dressed up fresh tonight. I, I, I hit myself with a die. Ooh. Oh, look at I these like demon that. boys. I like Gargoyle. Not my favorite model, but they make good statues. That's the boss at the end of there what, he is. Born Dungeon. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, he's like a Goro demon. Okay. Is he's he got the same a third model eye as in his head. Fiend? Or Sephiroth? Sephiroth. Oh. Not face, <sighs> obviously. He has a unique face and wings. Sephiroth, I don't think, had wings, but I guess a skeleton. Oh, he's big. I like it. Blank, thanks for the super chat. I failed to get in. New job will probably keep me from playing for a while. Enjoy my favorite normal raid. Ah, oh, sorry, Blank. Oh, sorry we missed you, but thank you for the support. Yeah. Oh, shoot, I walked up the edge. That actually scared me. Oh, oh did you die? I mean, I'll be okay, I assume, because we were in combat yet. No, nope, oh, I'm oh, dead. Yeah. I died first death oh, yeah. of the raid. I, I, I died of death. All right, well, here we go. I yeah, experimented. I just to see. For... <laughs> Hair trigger, Celestia, yeah, on that broom of yours. It. Hair trigger. I don't even have the option. I don't have the option to release. I what the do shit? not either. Wait, you walked off the edge too? Wait, what happened? How do we? Can someone? Now there's more people dying. Do, do we... Does everyone have to die? Are you like locked? How do we recover from this? How do I get out of this? I guess everyone has to jump off. Really? Do we just what? I don't know. What? I, I bet it's the strategy. Yep. What is happening? Why can't you that's res called, or why can't you release? That's called the uh, yeah teamwork. That, we just did a team building exercise. <laughs> We're all that's so whole, committed right now. Whole new kind of trust fall, man. I don't know. Uh, you were saying something before I died. Uh, I was saying thanks great, to Vivian. Way. Thanks to Vivian for the super chat. Oh, in real life or in game? Uh, both, both. But you know, I, I oh, like, thank, oh, I like thank what you. you did. I like what you did. Tonight. Yeah, yeah. No, thanks, thanks, man. I appreciate it. All right, should we blind this business? Let's blind this business. I'm gonna just uh, hit it with a ready check, eat All a right. sausage, and hope for the oh, best. Oh yeah, good call, good call. Let's get some. Uh... Fjord, thanks for the super chat. My PSU friend, uh, 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 or fr fried, not long after the stream started, was hoping to play the game of Password Chance, but I guess I'll be with y'all in spirit tonight. No! Oh, no! No, that's no good. Fane, 14, thanks for the super chat. 30 second wipe. Good prog! <laughs> Damn <laughs> yeah, right! Yeah, that inventory ain't being clean while I'm leveling. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. What? When I'm done, when I'm done doing leveling stuff, I'll clean out the inventory. I'm gonna assume that's a tank buster. What's it called? Chaos. Chaotic dispersion. That sounds hey, yeah. That sounds hit like a truck and proc my blackest night. So sounds right you know, to me. I think I think I got it. I think I got it, bro. I love saying bro, but I hate saying bro. Have you ever had this conversation with you, Kyle? No, but yeah, you know, bro, I, I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you. I like bro more after watching Adventure Time because they say bro a lot. Am I am I in that or not? In no, that? I it think it's like, after okay, the, it's on the edges. From what I saw, it's basically to. Okay. Looks oh, like, yeah. oh, I got one. We got double donuts. Oh, this game does water effects so well, man. Best water effects in an MMO. Oh, what's the knockdown? That's the one that shoots in the directions of those arrows. Yeah. Okay. I didn't move fast enough. I believe is my issue. The big bang. Big bang. Yeah. Hey, Kyle. The whole universe. <laughs> I don't know if you ever watched Big Bang, so you may not get that joke. The Big Bang Theory, like the. Yeah. What, why is this thing targeting me? Oh, that hurt. It hurt quite a bit. The most insulting show on television? What's it? Is it that The Big insulting? Bang Theory? Yeah, what's wrong with what's wrong with the Big Bang Theory? Uh, it, doesn't it just like trash on nerd culture all the time and terribly no, it's just, 
It's no, it's just like cringily on the nose about it. Okay. It's a little cringe. It's not the worst thing I've ever watched. I wouldn't say it's the best thing. It's it's, it's no Seinfeld. What what is the why? Oh, oh, yeah. what? Okay. I'm assuming it's a push. I think. I'm it's a push. Yep. I assume. And I think we don't want to end up. Oh, sh oh what? Where? Oh, what why? The butts? What? Okay. Ah, oh, okay. I think we're okay. Kind of get what's going there, but I think I moved too soon. Chaotic dispersion. Blackest night popped. There it is again. Oh yeah, look at me. Look at me sussing out yeah, the tank buster great. without yeah, asking. Yeah. Nice. All right, all right, all right. We're gonna get some distance here. We're gonna get some distance. Okay. Oh wait, double stack. Is um, it a splitter? I I don't know. Yeah, I guess we would have had to split in half. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to do with that information. Well, that seems... There's the big bang. By the way, uh, when you have a moment, look at the uh, look at the edge of the room. It's gorgeous. The skybox, the broken columns. I am a melee DPS, a... sir. This is a good looking fight pit. Sir, I'm a tank. I don't I want to hear it. You got spare time. You got threat. Have a cooldown. Have a cooldown. You can look wherever you want. You know I have cooldowns, right? <laughs> Tremble before what? the might of God. What's he doing? I don't know, but we can still attack him, so I'm gonna. Oh, yo, oh, damn. Whoa. Face. That hurt a lot. Oh, dude, that was cool. I took a shit ton of damage during that. Did he, be, did he become what's the dark crystal oh we need to blow that up <laughs> i love dark crystal oh shit i know shit, you mention shit. it all the time i know because i like it kyle i have an admission what i've never seen dark crystal you've never like jim henson's dark crystal you've never nope, sat down never and watched? seen dark crystal i was a labyrinth kid did you watch the netflix thing i watched the first episode and i was like i don't understand this he's Etherin. It's very pretty. And I liked hearing Mark Hamill up in that biz. Oh, wow. It's a good fight. Yeah, I like this fight. He's pretty. Chaotic dispersion. Pop on my blackest night. There it is. Feeling good in the neighborhood. Nice. Oh, there, there's that move again. Oh, okay, right, okay. So we okay. wait until the other yeah, one pops yeah, yeah, and then we yeah, move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I moved too soon in the other one. I, I got like nervous and jumped the line. He likes punishing the range who know not to stand out there. <laughs> Okay, we're good. I've got one now. This is just a big, uh, like, rewards you for not panicking fight. I like that. Yeah, it's like a stay cool. Knocked down. All right, I'm going to go over here and stand next. I think we kept oh, our cool oh, there, shoot. Kyle. Nope, I didn't. I hey. died. Oh, I made so far. First Kyle death of the yeah. night. Like the stream if you like watching Kyle die. Tradition. I just stood in it, too. There was like two things on me, and I was just in the zone. Get in the zone. <laughs> More of an O'Reilly's guy. <laughs> we don't have O'Reilly's here. But this. This is what our stream came for, by the way. Raiding while talking about local car parts stores. Yes, exactly. Hands down. You know Jeffrey's coming should, back. Should I, should, who's Jeffrey? The the giraffe. Uh, Toys R Us. That, that's Toys R Us. That's not auto parts. No, but you know. You can't go from Toys R Us to auto or auto parts to Toys R Us and expect me to keep up. I was just letting people know what they came for. <laughs> this and more. Is that is that when we angry? are come? Is that wind angry? Should the wind is angry. Is the, wind, not... is the wind friendly. Do you notice how no one is? <laughs> I do notice how no... no one's in the wind. Yes.
Oh god. Did you just run off the edge? Oh, you dropped it over there. See me. There's a more optimal place to hold this boss. I don't know about it, but the, the pushback makes me feel like as close to center as possible, I've probably. Got, yeah, I mean, I've got ways to get around positional, so it doesn't seem like it's a bad idea. Do all melee classes get positional avoidance mechanics? I don't know. I don't know. We Did we one-shot it? GG? Yeah. That was a relaxing fight. Yeah. I like that. I like that. It's it's standard without being boring. It's like a, yeah, the tank and spank, but you still had to dance. And I still died. So, you know, it happens. It was visually interesting. I like that fight. It was just, that was just a good old classic nice MMO ass fight right there. Yeah. Yeah. Chaos is dead. Now you dropped all GG, the lenses and the balls. So and the get to bits. the party. GG. G. G. So do I need on this stuff? Because I'll use it, but I, I just feel bad. This stuff, I agree, because I never have enough to buy anything. Okay. I hated taking up the space we have in Joey. If you want it, man, I mean, I like, go for it. I like it. the dress-up options. I like, uh... I like Lost Mythics, uh like whole outfit here kind of reminds me of what's the, who's the boar guy in demon slayer lost mythic let's see where yeah oh yeah 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 very much so. shirtless with like a wolf head oh you see link hanging out with us tonight you're off tank. oh yeah oh yeah makai's got it got the link the link uh cosplay going on it's some good stuff Bzzz, the matter is concluded. Alpha group is victorious. This also signals the completion of my experiments and the incontestable act of your first supremacy. I called it. And yet a process by which you consistently exceed your projected potential continues to confound my understanding. It is possible that that subject sits to position? To position? Supp supposition. Suppositions are correct that my calculations and simulations are fundamentally flawed. Do mortals truly boast some indefinable quality that I do not possess and cannot measure? Arrow. Logic loop malfunction. Resolution requires additional data. If the nature of your existence defies standard reasoning, then I must examine you from an illogical angle. Spicy. I subject the unknown to the imperfect. As subject Algon and do not will proceed to a supplemental stage. We'll read super chats after this. Thank you for the support, everybody. I see him rolling in. Don't worry, we won't miss. We won't miss you. Oh my! What? Where? Mm. Why? Please, I've altered this S world to reflect a recorded memory. Uh. It originates from a time when war had erupted on a distant star. I was deployed to the battlefield, and it was there that I engaged an enemy of unmatched strength. The Warriors of Darkness? Yeah. Contest ended prematurely, and I failed to bring down my foe. Subsequently, I lacked the data to fabricate a completely accurate simulation. Dragons? Dragons are from space? Results stemming oh. from such a subject are unreliable. Even should you be defeated by the incompetent or incomplete creation, I will still honor your previous victory and engage you in combat myself. That is, of course, assuming you survive. 
According to my past observations, this opponent will accept only death as a condition of defeat. Midgard Stormer? Are we getting the dragon fight? Ah, uh, he is kind of like a tiny Midgard Stormer, at least in the face, from what we've seen so far. Lanky boy. Yeah, yeah, he's got mid. He's got mini face. Oh, shit. Oh, oh my face. god. He's got so much red man. Worm of the dragon man. <laughs> and nemesis of my worm. Dude. This is not the fated specter that you know for a mortal conjures similar life from. You will contend with the true incarnation of the Father of Dragons at the height of his power and glory. Let's go! Omega, wait! Wait, what? You can't force student and Val to fight two battles back to back. They need time to regain their strength. He must be allowed to recuperate or the data to your for your testing will be skewed. He must queue up. <laughs> oh, look at that vortex in the background. We acknowledge that subject Malcolm and Urano Cross. You are permitted to leave. Re-enter the test world when your strength has returned to optimum levels. Yo, that is that is a cool, that's a cool addition. Dust. Yeah, I like Holy it. Vitamin shit. Has, has full strength. Yeah, yeah, man. That's oh man, that's so freaking rad. I like it. Holy shit. I didn't see that coming. I was like, and it'll be another Final Fantasy reference I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Mike says so oh, I heard you like the Nidhogg fight. I guess we're about to see, right? Yeah. We're about to see. Quad quick. Vivian, thank you for the super chat. If you haven't seen How to Drink on YouTube, he's the hairy alcoholic that made me realize I loved Caparinas? Caparinas. Thanks for the entertainment, y'all. I have Katie and I regularly watch Greg on How to Drink. We love Greg. Greg is good people and makes good drinks. Good channel. You should see. You should look him up sometime. Kylie has a great set. Okay. Because I know you've been you've been thinking about show sets lately. Yeah. So you should you should just give him a look. Okay. A good set. Good Will set. With that great. Baggins Wolf. Thanks for the super chat. If all your friends jumped off a cliff, would you do it too? The answer to this question is <laughs> and more on tonight's episode of Grinding Gear. If it's more convenient for us all to res, then yes. Yeah. Sorcarto super chatted. Chaos didn't need to knock you all down. <laughs> hey Kyle. Yeah. I get knocked down. But, but I get up again. Chaos never gonna keep me down. Aaron Steinberg, thank you for the super chat. Uh took some laxatives a couple hours ago. Thanks for keeping me entertained while my world falls apart. <laughs> Good luck to you, Aaron. <laughs> Best of luck. Sounds like you got a hell of a night. I hope it all comes out yep. okay. I hope in the end <laughs> it's all alright. <laughs> Jeff H, thank you for the super chat. <laughs> Aaron understands my sense of humor. <laughs> Every melee class gets true north, says Jeff H, uh, which lets you ignore positionals while it's off. Cool, I didn't know all <laughs> melees have positionals. <laughs> so sorry. Oh my God, flame task. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. You want to hold that boss at the corner so that people can hit the boss before and after the knockback without needing to walk into the wind. Cool. That makes sense. Isn't the knockback directional though? I thought it was all the same direction. You want to hold that boss in the corner so that people can't hit the if boss. If I held it in the corner, wouldn't I get knocked off, off the damn off the damn thing? I think when the wind was up, there was a chance that the knockback would happen. So I think at one point I had to run into the wind to maximize my chance of not going off the edge. Okay. It seemed like they were all, it was always the same direction, but I don't know. I'd have to go back and actually look at the fight to kind of analyze that. Sorcarto. Kyle, if you like capes, you should collect all of the Sigma scape bits and bobs to trade for the 
Carborundum gear set. Carborundum gear set. I do like capes. Okay, yeah. Oh, that that is a straight up cape. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. That, look, that's a nice look, cape. Let me, let me look this up. I want to see this now. I yeah, want to see look, what you're reacting to. Give it a little Google there. Um, googling it. Oh, look at that! How Star Wars it looks like a. I like it. I like Nano. That quite a bit. Thank you for the super chat. Seeing what the Dragon Star looked like, the Churning Mist back in Heavenwards makes a lot more sense, eh? The Churning Mist being all broken into pieces. Did the dragons do the Churning Mist? I know they like destroyed their own homeworld in like constant war. But I don't know much beyond that. Yeah, I thought it was like a like a like a like a like a war for Cybertron kind of a thing. Yeah, yeah. So they came to our planet. Interesting. It's a yeah. cool it's a cool bit of lore though. I like exploring Midgard Stormer more. Because he's just cool. And honestly, Keeper of the Lake is where I decided I was gonna keep playing this game. Ifrit interested me and made me curious, but Keeper of the Lake is where I went. Damn. This is going to be fun. What are you investigating over there? Don't worry about it. I'll, I'll, tell, I'll tell you later. Okay. I'll tell you later. Um, let's see here. Is it, uh, Vivian, thanks for the super chat. Play Monk. I am admittedly biased. My license plate says Monk Bane. <laughs> really? Oh, that's awesome. Awesome. I, I had a... Uh, a vanity plate up until I sold my most recent car. I had a I had a vanity plate for my last car, but it was car specific. What did it say? Uh, it said head gasket because that car was notorious for the head gasket failing. Wow. Yeah, I got so many people coming over and taking photos whenever I would take it into Ford because it was a Ford and it was a known Ford defect and there was a recall on the car. Mm -hmm. So every time I would go into Ford for an oil change, all of the techs would come out of the garage and take pictures of the car. Nice. That's cute. That's yeah, I'm glad you could use them. Had to be a Focus RS. It was a Focus RS. <laughs> it was a Focus RS. Yes. But I have since sold that car and felt like putting that license plate on a Mustang wouldn't make any goddamn sense. Oh, worth so. noting, I'm, I'm, ax I'm asking rhetorical, interesting questions. I do not want answers to dragon business. Dragons are cool. <laughs> do not. Dragons are cool. Yeah, do not spoil us. Um, All right. I'm talking to Alpha. Cool. Alpha says, quick, 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 quick. Alpha seems distressed, and Sid is no longer in sight or nowhere in sight. Duda. <clears throat> Duda, I'm right here. I don't think you could see me, but I'm standing right next to Alpha. Yeah, banished? I'm in the nether zone. It, it was not oh, a yeah, red look at that. I, I, I don't like red. They I forgot to. I've never had and you have to Wait, pay extra, what? right? What? What am I even clicking? Yeah, on? he's in the shadow realm. All right, Sid has vanished from view, but his voice is clear and strong. All right. My apologies. T'was not my intention to undermine the gravity of the situation with this diversion. Hey, Kyle. Hmm. Such diversion was not my intention. No. <laughs> it's just like a Garlean. Hey, Sid, your Garlean is showing. I'd noticed the kettle was boiled and thought some tea would soothe my nerves. I poured myself a cup and was halfway through drinking it before I realized my hand, not to mention the rest of me, had turned invisible. I understand the situation is unsettling, but I assure you I can still work unimpeded. Now, we had best discuss how to approach... You got McFly. Oof. Oh. <laughs> I, oh, ah, uh, it seems to have worn off. More sad quay. All the quays. No, 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 you're not to blame. I did ask you to fill the kettle after all. And I'd forgotten what Nero had said about your guard producing water with, uh, unexpected 
properties, although it seems the effects were rather different this time. Hmm. Welcome to the stream, Carrie. Enjoy. <laughs> In any case, it was pleasant to have a distraction from our greatest woes, however brief. We'll set the rest of the water aside for now and decide what to do with it later. Sounds like that's our, our Nero device for this next one. Right. Tuna, Val, I need you to talk about your forthcoming contest with Midgard Sormer. I made it with a dragon. Inform the men. Watching through the monitor, I could see that this worm appeared different to the one we know. From everything we've heard thus far, it seems that Omega and Midgard Sorma both hail from different stars, two dif distant worlds at war with one another. As a result of that conflict, the worm was forced to gather his offspring and leave his home behind, and after om evading Omega's pursuit over the course of an unimaginable journey, the father of dragons arrived here on our world. I love that dragons are aliens. That is so unique. Like, what the hell? Sorry, still getting over some of this lore. I'm assuming the entity you're to face is a younger, more vital Midgard Sorma, just as he was when Omega first encountered him, thousands of years in the past, a formidable foe indeed. Hmm. I like the Keeper of the Lake reference, but I think the top option is the one. My I'm character going. is Goku as fuck, so I'm going with that first reference. Yeah. Or that first answer. Just like, I'm going to I'm gonna do it. I'm going to figure it out. Aye. Right. Hopefully Omega's imperfect data will contain a flaw we can exploit. It certainly doesn't help matters that Omega's little surprise isn't registered as an official test subject. I can even use the terminals. Or sorry, I can't even use the terminals to search for the most basic information. I guess no, no uh, Google yeah. in Omega. With that in mind, Tuna and Val, I have a prop, uh, proposal. I wish to leave the completion of this supplemental stage entirely in your heroic hands. Rather than twiddle my thumbs, whilst you prepare to contend with the dragon, I mean instead to work on a strategy for our inevitable confrontation with Omega. And then, my friend, we will put a stop to this mad machine once and for all. Huzzah. Huzzah, Kyle. Huzzah. I'm glad we're in agreement. I'll ready my tools and you ready yours. We've, you've got a worm to slay. This is no clown face this time. Let's do it. <clears throat> Quest accepted. We've got some new members. We do. Welcome to the gearbox, Kyle. Sicilian Faraga and Vivian Rosier. Thank you so much for joining the, our membership. Yeah. Welcome to the Gearbox. Enjoy your emojis. You've, you've got access to grinding gear emojis now. And enjoy your members only chat in our Discord. We appreciate it. Thanks for supporting the two of us. All righty then. We require we got, people. We do require people. Um, sorry, current people, we are going to drop group and give other folks a chance to group with us. Sounds right. Um, I, I would like to put us on the honor code for this one and give console players a chance. So uh, if anyone yeah. joins faster than like 30 seconds, I'm going to assume you're a PC player and kick you. So you know, just so you know. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for helping us out and join us for the first wing here. Uh, yep. That's going to be in the Discord, in the Party Finder channel. I'm going to go help the family out real quick, and uh, I'll be right back, Garrett. Wonderful. Oh, and... All right, you're, uh, you're still in sun. here? Well done. Appreciate it, Dire Wolf. Wait, what the... Oh, shit! Dire Wolf, thank you so much. If you were gifted a sub, all thanks to Dire Wolf. All thanks to Dire Wolf. All right, I'm generating a new code for party password. All right, console players only. If I see you join quickly... I'm going to assume, I'm going to assume you're a PC player. Butcha. So honor code, honor code. We want to give console players a chance. So I'm heading over to the party password channel on our discord right now, and I'm dropping a new code. There it is. Again, this is for, let's, let's give console players a chance. Let's give the fact that it hasn't already signed or uh, filled is a, is a pretty good, 
That is a, that's a good point. Console players can't have keyboards too. And, and in fact, if you are a console player and you want to join with us, I would recommend plugging in a keyboard. Let the PC player RP begin. <laughs> All right, that, that was respectable. That was a respectable amount of time. Yeah, I agree with you, son. I agree. Bach Bix, or sorry, Bach Gix, thanks for becoming a member. Welcome to the Gearbox. Enjoy your perks. And Boopy, thanks for the super chat. Midgar phone home. You know, ET phone home, all that, all that good stuff. Kyle's back. Chaos, uh, you still have to manually scroll with controller, even with keyboard. I'm back. Well, there's that. You can still punch in numbers faster. Welcome back. Welcome back. YouTube finally implemented gift subs. Apparently, Tenebrae. Apparently. Might, yeah, we've heard there's like an option where you might have to accept that you would like one. So go into your settings and hit a little checkbox. Oh, that, that's a good point. You should, yeah. Now, there, there's somewhere in settings. And if anyone in chat knows the, the specifics, I do believe you need to go in and tell YouTube that you are you want to accept a, a, a gift itself to like be eligible. Thanks for reminding me of that, dude. I forgot about that entirely. Yeah. And, and we're I still... We've been on YouTube a while, but we're still learning some of the intricacies of how it behaves. And I saw someone suggesting uh, or saying they could tell me how to turn on my side buttons. I appreciate it, but I like uh, I like the cleanliness. Having all these on all the time is really too much. Side buttons? Yeah, so controller you can you can double tap to get additional menus. So I have access to with with my current configuration. I have one, two, three, four. Five, six. Next is the eight, I think, different menus of buttons I can use. No okay. problem. Eight times eight. How many buttons I can put on controller. So there's more than enough buttons to go around. That, that's, yeah, that's a lot. That's a lot. Well, shall we queue up? Let's do it. All right. Not Delta, not Sigma. Alpha. Alpha. Hey, Kyle, do, do me a favor. I've been mm -hmm. wanting this all night. Can you turn on your, your Omega voice filter real quick? Yes. Can you please say exterminate? Exterminate. I was not programmed to feel. <laughs> thank you. That's all I wanted. And thank you, Chaos Squall, and all of our wonderful mods tonight for keeping the thirsty, thirsty sex bots to the frick out of our chat. The dating site will be enabled. <laughs> so, Midgard. <laughs> We battle Midgard for the adult dating site. Let's do it. For control. <laughs> Get your thirsty, your stroller fan art here. That's what they should be advertising, yeah. Localize it. <laughs> we are accepting sponsorships from thirsty fan art websites. <laughs> he looks uh, great. He does. Oh, look at them showing off with these... This was technically 4.4, right? Yes, yeah. So this came out with 4.4. So, yes, yeah, so they, they 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 were like, oh, we figured out more cameras from Evilise. Let's get fancy. Oh, oh look, look at this. At, yeah. Look at this shit. I'm gonna hide my UI real quick. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Let's get some get nice uh, eye cam shots too. Uh, you do that. I'll do a, like a slow pan. Oh, this is looking yeah. great. Oh, look at this. Uh, look at the weird moons. This is all great. I see we've got a scholar with us because I see a fairy. This is gorgeous. I love this music too, by the way. It's good. The Keeper of the Lake. I just love it. Everything about Keeper yeah. of the Lake. Yeah. It was really, really good. Right. I'm going to run one of these. Sounds good. Just waiting on one more. Make sure they're okay. That everybody is ready. You Everyone's ready to ready. pull this biz? Do it. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, he's a directional. Yeah, he's a big boy with directional. He's got the donut. What you, oh, the, the half-eaten donut. What's he, what's he doing? What are you doing? As, as our good friend uh, Joe, <laughs> good friend, we never met him. <laughs> Joe Cat <laughs> says. <laughs> Oh, what? what oh, yeah, well, that so that's short, I guess. okay. So, so the spinning is the talent. Yeah, yeah. He did not, he did not give us much warning on that one. 
didn't hurt too bad. That or our healers are just oh, got okay, to. He's about again. to do it again. Uh, maybe not. Maybe. What are oh, you doing, wait. bro? There we go. There it was. There we go. That was a little awkward. Why do I have a thing on my head? Ah, oh, he did the thing right as the pop the thing. What was? What was that cone? I think. Did he, you see that? Yeah. I think he was. Oh. Okay. I'm exploding. Hawk mourn. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. Oh, he's a uh, Nidhoggin. Oh, he is Nidhoggin. He's doing the Nidhogg laser. Was Nidhogg from space too? If dragons are from space. Yeah, but I guess some of them could have been born locally. Why is no one running away from that one? Oh, once more. Now oh, he's oh, doing oh, a front whoa, roll. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's a run in. Yeah. That's a run in. Okay. When he does a front roll. Okay. Front roll is run in. Continuing to circle like a dog about to poop. Run out. <laughs> So it looks like he does one spin before yeah. doing anything. Oh no! That's okay. Okay. Oh shoot! He's stacking things with it. He's doing oh, more. Yeah, but look. Oh, but look at us. Look at us getting this shit. Oh. I learned something, Kyle. Nice job. I'm proud of you. So that, that's we're go in right yeah. again. Yeah, but it was the first one. Okay, let's go in again. Oh shoot! Oh, no, no, it's nothing no, new. Wait, what? What? Wow. So if it's two in a row, it's a it's a plus sign. I don't know. I do not. I do not rightfully know yet. He's doing ice. I'm just gonna run away. Okay, is that going to be the corners again? I'm going to assume that's corners again. I'm guessing there's a pattern that we have to figure out based on... There we yep. go, yeah. Okay, so that's, okay. Yeah, that's corners. Cool. Oh, where's he going? Oh, where where the he go? shit did he go? Oh, he, he's uh, doing Nidhogg orbs. Oh, shit. Oh, hey, we're all, all right. Oh, shit. Okay. I didn't get hit. Ah, nice. I'm so proud. I'm um, the best. A mortal key. Oh, that hurt like damn. Are we supposed to be beating up the keys? Is there something that's charging? I don't know. I'm going to beat up keys. Oh, I think so, because they're channeling to the dragon that's hitting yeah. me like a truck, so. Which is actually the dragon that was in Keeper of the Lake as well. Is it? I mean, it just looks like a dragon model to me. Yeah, it was, was one was kind of that color. The other one was, I think, blue. Oh, that's right. The end fight where there's like two of them. Yeah. And it's Midgar Stormer's head. You have, a, you have a hellacious memory for some of the stuff, dude. I can't remember oh. the name of anything on, on this planet, but... What is he about to do? Look at that giant big I don't know. We're all head. in the... Look at him doing whatever he's Yo. doing. It's beautiful. These sunglasses. What the frick just happened? He's back. Tail end. I don't know. I'm going to assume that's a tank buster of some sort. Yeah, yep. that looked like yes, one. it was. Yes, it was. Good call. What? What's that one? I don't think I've Enzo seen that. Oh, that's Flare. the leapy boy. That's like the I'm going to I'm going to do things in this direction. Oh, that's right. And they run. Yeah. Thank you for saying that out loud. I did not remember that symbol. Oh, cross? I think that's a. Is that a run out? Or you I don't just, know. Do we just eat it? Oh no, it's it's oh, ice. Oh, it's ice. Oh jeez. I will struggle with ice, man. I still haven't gotten ice after all this time. All right, that was one. All right, stay in. Okay. Can't do. <laughs> don't move. Uh, Ooh if I must. I'm down to not move.
All right, that's a forward roll followed by another forward roll. That's corners. Good oh, call, man. Oh, it's oh, but he did the thing at the same time. It's what offset. Is... Oh, the thunder. No. No, why, why am I cursed? Why do I suck so bad at this game? All right, so there's that followed by that. So over here is going to be a safe spot. I don't have to. Oh, oh, but he does a dash, the bastard. I hadn't seen the dash yet. Should have assumed he was pointing that way. Like, why don't I have to tank him? So he's going to come back to the middle of the arena. Yup. Yup. This is a cool fight. I like it. All right, that's a forward roll followed by another forward roll would be corners. That's corners. Cool. All right, I've got a thing on me. Cool, that oh, was, so that, that was just a dictates blast. that blast attack. Okay. Yeah. Ah, Morn. I don't think that's a thing I'm worried about. I haven't sussed out what Akmorn is, so I'm assuming it doesn't affect me. I think it's just a space laser. Tail end, that's the tank buster, Blackest Knight activating. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we got this. We gonna one shot this biz. Yeah, I'm happy here. That's, that's here okay. Here comes the ice. Here comes the ice. Thunderstorm. That's just the circles. He'll probably do some sort of uh, rolling biz here in a minute. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Oh, dash still works. Oh, he didn't. He didn't during the ice phase. Interesting. Exaflare. What was Exaflare? Oh, that thing. I'm gonna doom to the living. Don't kill him yet. Let me kill it. Yeah. 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 GG. Killing blow. One shot. One shot man eye level. I'm happy with that. What a fight. Yeah, that was, was cool. cool. Yeah. That was I, a cool fight. I like the pattern. That was a neat idea. I love it. Yeah. <clears throat> Kyle, did you did you know that Final Fantasy 14 is a pretty good game? Yeah, it's decent. <laughs> decent design. That was great. What a cool dude. Uh, right, well, I'm needing for cape powers. Cape powers? Cape powers. Okay, go, you, go for it, man. If I, if I decide I like really need some uh, Mog out of here, I, I will just get some groups together. I think I just, I, need that shit. Yeah. Need it. Need it. All right. So we, we thanked Botgix. We thanked Boopy for Midgar Phone Home, which means we're at Direwolf. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 369 damn near fine super chat that says slap them cheeks. Slapping them. I don't. I don't slap cheeks. I'm a tank. Yeah, that's true. Um, yeah, which really, you know, honestly bums, bums me out. Get it? Bums me out. I get it. I see what you did there. Banger McThird, thanks for the super chat. Nidhog is mid sun, so technically he was Midgard Sormering. Oh. So there you go, Kyle. So that I mean, is it like is it like U.S. rules? If you're born in Aortia, can you run for Aortia president? Do we no longer call you? <laughs> was um, yeah, but was Nidhog born in space? I guess it was, or was he born in me, but... Oh, that's a good point. Yeah. Is it a spoiler? I don't know. Nid I, we're done with Nidhogg, right? I assume so, but I don't right? know. Like, he's got more eyes. I don't know. Right? Don't don't answer that. Don't answer. Smiles, please. Smiles, please. Smiles, please. Uh, Shiro, thanks for being a member for three months. I recommend cranking the music to 11 for the next one and then up a few more until the neighbors complain. Very well. I have very cool neighbors. So, I don't know. I don't think they would complain. Also, you should hear the neighbors next to them are loud as hell. So I could get away with murder in terms of volume. Gross. They, they do play good music, though. I can't really complain. Oh, that's, that's all right. And they usually shut it down by, by like nine. So it's like, you know, you do you. You, you have fun. Themselves. You have fun. Saya, thanks for being a member for two months. Just as GG well played. Well, GG to you, Saya. Thanks for supporting Kyle and me. And also other people are saying it was explained later by Mid uh, by, by Midgard and we're just not remembering the whole Nidhogg where he was born thing. Okay, cool. Yeah. Maybe he came to the star with seven eggs in tow. 
Uh, this should have been set in game by now. Okay. It probably was, and we're just forgetting. So he brought the eggs to the planet. Yeah. So we're born here, man. So yeah. Nidhogg's an Aeorzean. There you go. Yeah. Sid says, play the best song in the world. Another stunning victory, Valentuna. I felt that breath catch in my throat on more than one occasion. Yet even as I watched the battle rage, I was struck by an idle thought. Did you notice the resemblance between Midgard Sommer and Shinryu? No, no, not at all, you nut. We what were are like, you talking about? We were talking about Nidhogg, dude. What? Unlike most primals, Shinryu's form had no basis in a, uh, any system of belief. I've heard the theory that the summoner was simply influenced by the majesty and the power of the elder primal Bahamut. But now I am beginning to think there might be another explanation, that the primal took its shape from the ancestor of all dragons on Hydaelyn. I, I, I don't see that. <laughs> take, all right, Grandpa, take your pills. The widely held concept of how a dragon appears has for centuries upon centuries been rooted in depictions of Midgard Sormer. The summoner may not even, uh, oh, sorry. Summoner may not have even sought to imitate him specifically. Wait. Oh, the summoner of Shinryu. I've, he said, I've heard the theory that the summoner was simply influenced by the majesty and power of the elder prim primal Bahamut. He's talking about Shinryu? I guess they're not talking about Shinryu's summoning by the griffin. Because that wasn't like a summoning. Maybe. I guess they're just talking about them being worms, right? I, I guess. I mean, other people are saying, pointing out that Shinryu had a red mane, which I guess is a good point. Yeah, but Shinryu was like thick. Midgard Stormer was like a skinny little... Yeah. You know, look like lived. <laughs> Shin. I mean, if you're comparing him to Shinryu, Midgard Stormer is the Machine Gun Kelly of dragons. So the Griffin was influenced by the majesty and power of the Elder Primate Bahamut. Why would the Griffin know about Bahamut and care? Shinryu was a legend and authored. So was Shinryu summoned in the past? I forget. I forget the whole Shinryu lore. I'm going to be completely honest. Yeah, I know. I know Bahamut and Dalamud. I know all that. So just say, I like I like Schwann's explanation that Midgard Stormer is the OG Noodle Dragon. Okay. This is where I would just want to go like look up Shinryu on a wiki, but I don't want to yeah, potentially spoil yeah. myself on things. There's a machine's connection to. Where were you at in the Sid? Did you finish all this? No, no, I was okay. just reading chat until okay. you seemed. Go, cool. feel, feel free. Sated. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. All right, since so says subconscious thoughts and memories alone could have guided the similarity, not that I have any way of confirming this theory, of course. Nevertheless, it is interesting that Shinryu's summoning should lead us to Awakening Omega, a strange twist of fate when you consider the machine's connection to Midgard Sonar. Hmm. Well, whatever else destiny has in store, you've already bested the opponent that Omega itself failed to overcome. A feat was worthy of celebration, I'd say. But not too much, you have work to do. It's in school night, warrior of light. All right, it's all come down to this man. Interesting. In the end. Are you ready? Doesn't even matter. I was thinking corn more than Lincoln Park, but okay. Uh, Your move, Omega. You know, if my hair gets much longer, I can do the Sid haircut. You could. You could. You, I could just you look good with the beard, too. Yeah, bring it. I, I, I've been trying to decide whether to shave my beard off or not. You know, I came back from vacation with the start of one, and I'm like, I haven't had a beard in a few years. I might, might grow it. They're staring. And I'm going gray. Oh, what's up, Bailey? How you doing, bud? Big Quay energy. Big Omega energy, sir. 
Thanks, Umurashi. Appreciate it. I've, I've had a pretty thick one in the past. Kyle, you're up. Oh, I'm still, uh, the, the sound alerts are still going. Really? There we go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Could have nothing. Hang on. <laughs> Shut down and initiate it. All fours, board. experiment, and supplemental testing concluded. This is a groovy little song. Discarding Cat World. System resources rerouting to primary operations. Oh no, the egg! Congratulations, Alpha Group. As the last surviving test subject, you have removed every challenger in your path to reach me! I do am eager to meet you in battle. The origin of error I observed between my simulations and your practical performance against Big Ultrama necessitates direct and immediate analysis. Confrontation imminent. Prepare for unmitigated hostilities and activate the relocation device to enter the arena. This is it, then. He's feeling things. Omega's power might s seem overwhelming, but trust an old Sid. I have a fair idea of where its weakness lies. And I've been working on something to exploit that vulnerability. I just need a little more time to prepare. All right. What you doing, Sid? Hmm. Other than being handsome. Deal with the ter Do it. Make a fist. Do boy, it. Is, his hand is shaking. Anime up, boy. There you go. Did you just tell him to anime up? Yeah. Sorry, dog being weird. All right, what's he say here? First things first, we make a few adjustments here, like so. And, ah, ah, Alpha. Do you have any of those tricks and tools left over? I want us to have as many options as possible, so let's lay out our, or lay our cards on the table, as it were. What? Uh, huh. the hell just happened? <laughs> I have, I have questions. What do we have here? Some sort of gem, a couple of stones? Was that a turd? And one single guard. This makes things bigger, does it? Or is it smaller? Right. It was foolish of me to even ask. We'd best leave you in charge of when and how to use your special tools. From your butt. Ah, yes, I almost forgot.
<laughs> I'm going with the last one. Mm, that's a good one. I'm going with I'm sure you'll do fine. Oh, you touch it with your hands, man. Oh, never mind. He's giving him a push. Here, you should carry this as well. I filled an empty bottle with the invisibility water from the kettle. Heavy quotations there. It might just prove useful in the right situation. Some kind of duty action. Listen to me, Alpha. Up until now, Omega has poked and prodded us from one mad experiment to the next, and honestly, we have no idea of what might happen in there. But between us, I believe we have the knowledge and the skills to prevail. If you see a chance to make a difference, I want you to take it. All you need is faith in yourself, and a little courage to see it through. Square Enix to really sell Final Fantasy motivational posters. <laughs> Hang them in the library. It's, it is a wildly positive game at yeah. the end of the day. Right. Jesse should have d uh, that device put together by now. Let's head outside, shall we? Hmm. Sid seems like the kind of guy that would do finger guns. <laughs> I'm just, <laughs> just putting it out there. Not, you know, I don't feel it myself, but you've been playing Sid more, so maybe Zap Sid <laughs> would do finger guns. Oh, shit. Uh, we got some thanks to Dole out before we move on. Uh, Saya, thanks for, becoming a or for being a member for two months. Oh, sorry, we got you already. You said GG well played. Uh, Udiar. Welcome to the Gearbox. Thanks for joining. Thanks for becoming a member. Arcade Ashdown Super Chatted. Boys, we are so friggin' hyped for our everything from 4.3 out, cuz no dang joke, it is just banger after banger after banger. Awesome. Glad to hear. Look forward to UDR, it. UDR also Super Chatted said, hey, managed to figure out why YouTube didn't allow me to sub. So here, have my first sub and some Super Chat to support you guys. Enjoy Omega. Thank Thanks you. so much, UDR. Appreciate it. And then Daykoth uh, super chatted, hit like or Kefka will haunt Garrett tonight. No, <laughs> no, he's no, dead. Daykoth. He's dead. That's not okay. We did it. <laughs> <laughs> we got another shame super chat. Coral, thank you for the super chat. It says over 1,000 viewers and only 500 likes. Shame, shame, shame. Thank you for the support, Coral. Appreciate it massively. Thank you for taking your support and then uh, shaming other people to support us. Exactly. I appreciate it. Yeah, I really. People say there's no culture of giving on YouTube. I don't know. I don't know who says that. I don't know. I'm wrong. I don't know who says that. I'm wrong. No, no, no cloud emojis. No cloud emojis. Suribachi just gifted five grinding gear memberships. Awesome. So if you were gifted a membership, make sure you thank Suribachi and at them. Or if you just think that's a cool thing to do, you should at Suribachi and tell them that yeah, you think it's a cool thing yeah, to do. Cool. Cool thing yeah. Out. Thank you very much for the support, Suribachi. All right. I'm going to click on Sid here. All right. I'll head straight back to Ralga's Reach and collect my new toy. I do still need to run through a final inspection, so feel free to rest in town in the meantime. We'll discuss strategy the moment I'm finished. Okay. It's important to rest. That's one thing I've learned from this. And then oh, yeah. Alpha says, says all the quays. I like it, though, because so many times in fantasy games, in RPGs, they're always like, hurry, you must go quickly now, blah, blah, blah. And they're always telling you to go, go, go. And then... You fart off on side quests. There's no actual danger. You can stand in the middle of the Reaper for as long as you want before engaging it. I like that they do this. Alpha seems concerned with Sid's well-being. You have a feeling he wants you to follow him. Uh, all right, if you if you insist. I'm down. Yeah, let's follow Sid. Where are we? Or, or no, it's Alpha. Oh, wait, we're going all the way to Ralgar's Reach. Dear yeah. God, I'll I'll pay. Okay, Actually, very I think well. Actually, I think we're in a cross world. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Party, so it ain't, it ain't gonna matter. All right, well, it's Ralgar's Reach then. All right, where are we going? Going over here. We're gonna go talk to Jesse's girl. Actually, it's just Jesse. We're just talking to Jesse. 
No, we're not. I I stand corrected. Oh, uh, okay. I'm actually going back through the test the text here and reading it. With the thought that perhaps Sid we earlier were talking to Jesse about how he was kind of involved in the Dalmud moon. So he was actually saying that unlike most primal, Shinryu's form had no basis on any system of belief, merely that it was emulating the power of the elder primal Bahamut. So the Griffin, the summoner, just wanted to summon something really badass. And that's what he got, was oh. Shinryu. Gotcha. And Sid was likely talking about the dragon business because he was related to, slightly involved in any way to the Dalamud thing back in 1.0 that they've been kind of playing with here. Hmm, okay. So, yeah, okay. What, why are you talking there? I was, I was reading back in the event log. Gotcha. Gotcha. Destination. Well, I'm going to click on the destination. I'm clicking it too. <laughs> I'm not recording this. I wish I had. I guess I could go to the book. That little shot of, of, of Alpha is great. Oh, man. We're He's getting, really freaked out, man. Yeah, we're getting Sid character development here. Oh, hit me with that, Kyle, because we all know who this is. I'm assuming he's still weak, though. Like, he's hobbling out. He's like, You're still a bit shaky there, old friend. Yep, yep. I wish oh, they gave you that at the hospital instead of those paper things. Uh, what, a Jedi robe? Yeah. <laughs> Nero, they let you out of bed, did they? <laughs> Trying to hide the fact that I don't love you, you bastard. After studying the data collected from the battle between Omega and Shinryu, one is led to certain conclusions. Of all the primal's attacks, Shinryu's burst of lightning was the one thing that pierced the machine's defenses. Omega, it, see, it would seem, is it vulnerable to electrical energy. Aye, all the available evidence supports such a theory. It is likely an intrinsic weakness that even Omega itself cannot fully compensate for. Yet, be that as it may, I imagine it can still shrug off shocks generated by ordinary means. We'll need to hit it with a truly gargantuan blast of energy. Nero the White says <laughs> Swatana in the chat. And so you made that. You based it on Mita's design, didn't you? The plan for a lunar transmitter? It'd be Midas. Oh, Midas. When my father was establishing a connection between the transmitter and Dalamud, he invented a method for accumulating and converting energy on a vast scale. Too vast, as it turned out. But the technology which leveled an entire town may be exactly the tool we need for the task at hand. Okay, would you be willing to, to pause here while I go dig up some old footage? Sure. Because it might just be that this is being used as a universal item here. And like, you know, the, it's a set piece. They're reusing it. You know, uh, uh, techno babble, visual techno babble. But isn't this the exact same machine that those two former blue justices, what are they called? The blue Alpha Nose betrayal group. Oh, the, the Crystal Braves? Yeah, the, isn't this the same thing that the Crystal Braves were, like, popping there and being like, I'm sorry, everybody, <sighs> right before the Shinryu wake up? Uh, Doss and Chad saying, yeah, it's the same model. Yeah. But is this a device we should understand? Like, does it have meaning here? Let's see. A lot of people are saying the model gets reused a lot. Okay, so this is just kind of generic techno device. So this isn't generic magitech. Okay. Cool. So no no need to connect it with the Crystal Braves dudes popping something. I like Comor who says it's a MacGuffin model. Okay. One other person said it's a coffee maker, and then Isran followed up with that coffee is bomb, literally. There we go. Okay, cool. 
The Garlean Black Box. I like that too. Oh, man. Some some bangers in here. Uh, Coral, thank you for the super chat. Said, can we get a guess for what the next two fights will entail? What do you mean, can we get? Oh, what we think it'll entail? There's two fights? I thought we were, there was one fight left. I thought, yeah, I thought there was only one fight. I mean, there's usually, here it is. Okay, it's actually a different device. Never mind. Are you showing chat? Yeah, yeah, they're seeing the video. If you want to look it up, it's, um, it's the Heaven's Ward 3.5 Papalimos containment video on our Dropbox. Gotcha. No, no, no. It's yeah, fine. it's a whole no. different device, actually, visually. I believe you. I believe you. Because it's something I'm still, I'm still kind of curious about, like, what exactly these... I think they just blow a bomb, though. I think they're just literally pushing down a bomb lever. Acme style. Oh, it's always four fights. Is it four fights? My God, my brain. I thought it was going to be four fights, so I was a little surprised we were going to Omega. So that's cool. I'm glad gotcha. there's two fights. Maybe we get Omega and Omega. So that would suggest we get like Omega in like Omega form. And then he, I, I'm still assuming he's going to do like a, the perfect human being is a human. Uh, I got arms and legs and, and, and all of it. I'm a perfection. You know, like they made a Reaper human. I mean, I'm, I'm going with a, I'm going with a very like simple explanation, which is we have, we, we have Chekhov's shrinking card. So maybe the first fight he's small and the second fight we have to fight the full Omega. Yeah, we haven't done Nero's, like, gimmick fight yet, so I'm guessing we have a gimmick coming up for the fight. Okay. Anyway, I will continue with Sid. All right. Who, re who reads, who says, I've made my own improvements and triple-checked the calculations on parchment. The idea is sound, and Jesse has done a fine job assembling the parts. I fail to see the problem. Are you afraid of... What are you afraid of, Garlon? punch in i don't know the device should give us the edge we need tis just whenever i look at it i'm taken back to those dark days after the incident i remember bodies melted by searing heat i remember the bereaved and feel the weight of their silent accusations i remember the empire's remorseless response we turned outwards in search of answers but the inventions we created to ensure our future were used Instead, to destroy lives, to wage war. And that's why I fled, came to Weortia, and swore to only employ technology for benevolent ends. But naught is ever so straightforward. Every connection I have forged with the people of this realm reminds me of that fact. Often the act of living itself is a never-ending struggle against a world determined to oppose you. Is that a flashback to Crystal Tower? Yeah, that was Crystal Tower Catman. Now, and now this is uh, uh, Alexander, yeah. You can have the best of intentions and still cause hurt to others or, your, or uh, uh, to yourself or others. But tis in confronting these wounds that we learn the better path, how to ga grasp these moments of true contentment. What drivel? You never used to bother with all these tedious introspection. Feeling our mortality, are we? Mayhap I am. I had no such hesitation when I was a student. It was all bright and shiny innovation on the double. And later consequences be damned. Now though, I don't mind thinking through the outcomes taking the time to produce just one rigorously tested and carefully designed invention. Tis a reflection, I think, of just how much there is in this world I care about now aside from myself. The optimism uh, is palpable. I don't understand you at all. <laughs> it's like me listening to Kyle talk about things sometimes. But I suppose, if anything, Omega and its unfettered testing methods represent the student you once were. And if you insist that your present self is better than is the better one, then you'd best prove it with that device of yours. I suppose I must. 
There you go. My hand is my own. No, Nero. Although it is hardly fair to compare my youth to Omega's solitary existence, I always had the second best student in class pushing me to excel. I seem to recall a twinge of irritation any time he would outscore me on an exam. <laughs> I've been out of bed too long. I'd better go and lie down before I fall over or vomit. <laughs> This is one of my favorite relationships in the entire yeah. game. <laughs> Nero hated that. Every moment. That's cute. Yeah. It was almost like Nero recognized that Sid might not need him anymore to push him, but then Sid invited him back in. That's super cute. I'm just making a quick tweet because A, I forgot to tweet earlier, and B, we're, we're heading towards the end, so it seems yeah. like a good time to do so. Yeah, sounds good. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just reading a, oh, a tweet from someone on there who says, Of course, take your time, enjoy your journey through Final Fantasy XIV, and then all caps. Mia is giving me a chub. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> you got me. I shouldn't have read that out loud. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't have voiced my thought. <laughs> I should not have voiced that out loud. You got me. Respect, you got me. You got, you got me. A fish? That's oh, gonna get clipped. Uh, yeah, okay, yep. Oh, yeah. Someone, yeah, someone's I've... gonna someone's gonna clip that. Yep. Well done. Well done. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Y'all are bad. Y'all are bad. All right, say what you got to say. Bring it, First dude. Alpha, and now you. Come to check on my progress, have you? Well, I'm happy to report that everything is set and ready to go. Once you're finished with restocking, repairing, or whatever it is you adventurers do, then we can head back to the rift and confirm our strategy. All right. Speak with Sid and enter the dimensional rift. Off to the peering stones. Ready. <laughs> Mr. Hippopotamus. You need Jesus. Hey, there's people who like hang out at the entrance of the game and hand out all sorts of weird things. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Everyone just hanging out, having a good time. Yeah. You social bastards. Kind of mm, good evening to you, sir. <laughs> Will you be descending into the yawn? Yes. <laughs> Chubbing success. <laughs> All right. I'm going to start reading because it's... Oh, you're here already. Yep, here. Oh, shit. I clicked. Mother... Apologies for the delay, but I think you'll agree the Ironworks' latest invention was worth the wait. This is the control module for something I've dubbed the Omega Jammer. It will allow you to generate a colossal burst of lightning at any point of your choosing. The effect won't disable Omega itself, of course, but it should be strong enough to knock out its armaments. It will remain here and operate the main body. Oh, sorry. I'll remain here and operate the main body of the device. I want to do everything in my power as an engineer to ensure that you emerge a victor. It all comes down to this. Oh, okay, cool. Sounds like he'll handle it, hopefully. And I don't have to press the duty button. Let me just explain the button. Final family, thank you for the generous super chat. Hope you guys enjoy the fight and the music. Three, two, one, go hard. Chubbs not included. Chubbs not included. <laughs> <laughs> Is this an ongoing joke that I'm unaware of? Do people hand Chubbs and try and see if they can get streamers to say, oh, so-and-so gave me a Chubb. I don't know. Also, people have been talking about chicken tenders all night, so I have no idea. Oh, don't bring that up. Don't bring that up. Chicken tenders? We end this so late. Oh, you want chicken tenders? And I tenders? usually I usually have a cocktail too. So at the yeah. end of it, it's like you you finish the night at the bar. Mm. And it's like I want fast food. Sure. I want that like that fast food that you get sure. on the way home from the bar. And I can't and the, the, the scariest part about all of this, Kyle, is I could walk to a Taco Bell from You my could? House. Good? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, I've got my background music yeah. ready. Let's get some All right. The brave soul. Let's get in here. Uh, recruit members. Alpha Escape 3.0. Join the Discord for a party code. 
there it is. Uh, yeah, we're not doing 8008. I already did the boob joke. We did the boob joke. Please allow others who have played tonight the code. to join if you have already joined us in this evening's activities. Yes, that is very important. It is, you know, there's, there's only, there's, you know, we have no way of enforcing this, but it is honor code. Please, if you've been able to run with us recently, give others a chance. So, Ricardo, thank I'm you for the membership. Over, heading over to you. party password. Oh, so Ricardo? Hell yeah. Welcome to the gearbox, Ricardo. See you hanging out here all the time. Welcome to the gearbox. And right. welcome, to the, welcome to the party, pal. I should say pals. All right. There's six of you, in addition to Kyle and myself. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's roll, butthole. I'm excited. It's been a that's, long that's time me. coming. I shouldn't have said that. And that no one here is a butthole. <laughs> I thought it was endearing. <laughs> Join, start recording, commence. Let's see it. Time to fight Omega. Yeah. Get your tenders ready. What's with the tenders? I don't know. I don't know what the tenders are about. Also, I, I prefer tendies. I am a big fan of, the t of calling them tendies. Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, it's an aperture. Yeah. Oh, and here comes Omega. Hey, Kyle. Hmm. Aperture science. Do a must if you can. Before we get nice. all of those. Oh, the music. I know character. Thanks for the super chat. We need some Zelda jam soon. That would be a good one. Dude, this music rips. Chris Major, thanks for the super chat. Support our bromance.com. Should forward to Sid and Gaius's wedding fundraiser. <laughs> Wait, is that it? What? Yeah, because no one knows what he says for the opening words, and it kind of sounds like chicken tender. Oh, was that what he said? It sounded like it. Oh, I was. I didn't. I wasn't listening. I was reading. Shit. I'll have to go back and I'll play it back. I'll play it back. Mega Jammer. All right. Uh, I know nothing. It's a false you want to blind pull this biz? Yeah, let's do it. You're getting pretty good at guessing tank busters, too. So let's rock. Oh, wait, I need some food. I'm hungry. Too late, I pulled. I'm good. I'm in. That was the tank buster. It didn't hurt very good. Or think, our healers are amazing. I think it hurt everybody. I think that was the oh. heal check, as it were. What is mustard bomb? Is that it? Yes, yes, it was, and I didn't do anything for it. Uh -oh. I'm sorry, healers. Oh. oh wow! Nice job, everybody. That was a good split. That was beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. fire! Oh right, that's the thing that drops the thing. I should have mustard bomb. Here we go again. Oh, good idea getting under it, yeah. That's a, that's a good call. Starboard wave cannon. Oh, oh shit. But, but, but hold on, what's the orientation? Oh, north. Oh, so oh my god. Oh, oh wow. my god. Wait, but that was also... Star oh, was, was it his? Oh my god, I'm so... I do not know boat directions. Held also, rocket what, armament. Does what, that mean we need we... to? Should we interrupt them? Oh, they're all. Oh fit. god! What? What? Oh, they, they can be attacked though. Why? Why can they be attacked? Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, 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 holy shit! Sorry, I didn't mean to turn him in panic there, but oh, I definitely no, turned okay. him. I thought he was mad at me. I turned him in panic because I was like, ah, where do I go to avoid the fists? Peripheral synthesis. More coming. I think you're just supposed to burn them down yeah. with us. I don't know how they're dying okay. so quick, but thank you to our team. We're doing great work on that. When are we supposed to electric? I don't know. Button? I already electric him once and it's back, so it's a short cooldown. I got scared when the fish showed up. Well, I just hit it for shit. So, oh, yeah, I can do it again? All right, what's he doing? Oh, uh, flying, apparently. Is that a safe zone or a not safe zone? I have no idea. Should we beat up that thing? It's untargetable. Now it is. You can target it. Okay. Executable. 
Whoa. What Wait, the? People are going to do things? Uh, feels should I help? Like you should stand in a thing, so I'm gonna stand in a thing. I did a thing. I stood in a thing and it seemed like I helped. Well, you were digital, if you noticed. The digital effect is cool. Oh, look at this. I assume one person can you, per can, thing. Can you share? There's only four of them. No, yeah, you can totally share. Four people again. Final sequence initiated. Force quit. Uh, <laughs> I'm scared? Am I? I, th I think we're supposed to burn him before force quit finishes because that's a long cast. What? Why did he do this to me? What? Oh, oh, you're dead. Yeah, by tradition. I don't know. I suddenly ran to the side. It, well, honestly, dude, we wouldn't do well if you survived. Like, it's... I feel like when you die... It's oh, tradition. Uh, yeah, don't stand. Don't stand in the middle. I'm spread. scared. Why are you all standing there? Oh, wait, what? Okay, what? maybe Why you there... should be there. I don't know. There's arrows pointing here. I'm... A conductive focus? Something we can do with this? Oh, it's kind of clickable. Wait, oh, are we all... Oh, you can use your it? jammer on it. Oh. Okay. Oh, we were like powering Charging it up. Charging a shield. Man. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Okie dokie then. Ice hurt a bit. Bring the middle a little bit here. Peripheral synthesis. Flamethrower. Oh, shoot. Oh, he's, he's like double stacking yeah. avoidables now. There's the synthesis. Uh, synthesis, synthesis. I can't get it out. The synthesis again. All right, I'm going to move because this ah. drops at the thing. We got corners again. I'm going to drag him back to the middle after all this shiz. Oh, stack. Oh, cute. That was cute. Oh, we lost Solomir. Mustard bomb. That is... I need to pop cooldown. That's what that is. Starbird. Wave cannon. I think that's... Decide. Hey, I got it right. Oh, wow, coming. yeah, I, I was not ready. Larbird. What is Larbird? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. What the fuck oh, was that? Oh, shit. Shit. <laughs> what is Larbird? <laughs> Larbird. I don't know. It's Port and Starbird. What the, the, the shit? The healers are very busy. You're all doing great. What is this shit? Old English? I'm confused. Oh, uh, there's a giant fist in the middle. Yeah, look oh. out. Oh, oh God. Thank you, safe friend. Woo! The master hand just tried to end us, man. The people in chat are saying in Japanese, it's just right and left. That is What? Bold. That's not fair. Next, you're gonna say Oriante talks normal in Japanese. <laughs> no, he actually has a Jersey Shore accent. Ooh. Starboard is that side. Oh, yes. Oh, what? No, not again. Oh my god. It's like a 50 50 chance, right? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, and we got the giant fist back again.
Electric slide. Oh, is that what the, the stack attack is called? Oh, I guess so. I didn't notice that it was electric slide before. That's really funny. Starbird is over. Uh, how did you memorize this? And then he turned uh, around. I don't even know. Star Starbird shit. is. Oh, shit. Now I fucked that up. Yeah. No, my brain hurts every time, man. I'm just like, I'm trying to piece it together. I'm like a dedicated healer. He's not even a boat. Like, what the hell? Mustard bomb, blackest night. <laughs> what, what does my intense face look like? Would, would someone describe it, please? <laughs> oh, we got two down. We're taking, we're taking some serious casualties here. Yeah. Oh, we're close. Whoa. We're getting there. This Ouch. fight with a lot of help. Atomic Ray. Just stay calm. Why did... He got so angry. Why do you shoot a big missile? Well, he is a robot. Big, big fist. Big, big fist. Shit. That is a big fist. We all okay? We all appear to be okay. Big Fist is back. Oh, jeez. Way you stack shit like this, man. Oh, I did not realize there was two fists. I don't think I can hit um. I help. <laughs> oh wait, that's okay. That's the missile. That's the thing that killed me. I think it's that thing. Yeah, it's that explosion. So the thing that's the like the laser target. Yeah, the laser target. I was by where it went off. GG. Oh my god. That was a big hats off to our healers. Uh... We had a lot of deaths that fight. I died three, maybe four times? Okay, well, we know there's one more fight, so what, what happens that's bad? That's what he's what gonna bad become things a human. happens? Yeah, he's gonna open up, and he's like, I have made organic... I will become a wall. Yes. A wall. Woo! GG to our party. Big. I oh, do the glare at e emojis are... Fucking killing me in chat. <laughs> All the clarets. <laughs> uh, that is, I love that. That was entirely community driven too. People were like, we need a glaret emoji. <laughs> it's required. We also now have clog or, or coggers. Yeah. So enjoy. Oh, there they are. There's the coggers. Exactly. Yo, G freaking G. Oh my God. Well, nice job healers. Big shout out to, um, cross here i saw you channel in those long long reses for me i appreciate you getting me up to the fight and let me participate yeah yeah holy shit oh my uh, god. oh my god all right let's take a minute um i'm gonna pop a champagne for our group here because that was intense oh. <laughs> i guess i did yell he's not even a boat balmog or not balmog duraxis that's your that's he's your not world. a boat He's not a bow. Why I, the fuck is he having a bow? I, don't think I even got one of those by chance. Oh, I gotta go. Hold on. Hold on. Google. What is larboard side? Yeah. I thought it was port. Port is. Larboard is also port. Why? <sighs> Why localization? So starboard, starboard is stage right. Port and larboard are stage left. Left and right? Well, Larboard actually is a bit of a tell because it's got L, so it would can be the boss's left, which is your right. Can you be a boat? Well, my left, right. Actually, no, you, you'd be behind them. So. Can you be a boat if you're autonomous? Uh, we call... Uh, yes. Because satellites, we call satellites unmanned craft, and he is an unmanned craft. But boats are manned craft, usually. Right, exactly. So why is he... he, he I'm, I'm saying as a... I mean, I guess you could argue he's a ship when he's in transform flight mode. 
Mm. Right? Like a, like a spaceship is a ship. But does a spaceship have to carry people to be a spaceship? Otherwise, is it a drone or satellite? All I want is fuel for the fire for Koji. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Give me fuel, give me fire, give me that's what I desire. Which is, yeah. Um, we have some thanks to Let's do that. Uh, Ryan, thanks for the super chat that just says, what the hell is a larboard? Preach. So apparently we're not alone, Kyle. No, we're in good company. No. I, it was I a like cool Preach. Fight, I, I, like I, I don't watch his Final Fantasy content because I don't want to get spoiled, but I like Preach. Final family, thanks for the super chat. Chicken tenders, come ready to fry. Now your dinner, I'm waiting to try. I can hear it. I hear it. Dayka, thanks for the super chat. This fight is murder for my dyslexia. <laughs> I don't Andy's even have this turning. idea, and and yeah, this this fight was oh yeah, and the turn, yeah, Andy's man, turning around. that ain't cool, man. That ain't cool. What was the song Fitchel. called? What's the name of the song that was playing? I don't know. I don't know. Fitchell, thanks for the super chat. My static could not keep starboard and larboard straight, so we called it Sean side and Laura side, depending on which healer was on safe side. Okay, <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Oh my god, it's apparently it's called Escape with a capital S and a lowercase e. Escape. Wait, why Bob is this Claro. showing? Oh, interesting. So this is showing in the Shadowbringers soundtrack on Spotify. I guess because we're on the other side of the mountain. Ooh. Yeah, this is a, this is a Shadowbringers Or soundtrack. the soundtrack released before point, 4.4 4 dropped, because I've noticed that like some of the late Heaven's Ward music is on the Stormblood soundtrack. Yeah, or sometimes they put out like a bonus soundtrack. Yeah. Uh, Ama Claro, thanks for the super chat. Fun fact, Koji got in trouble for the localization since English was harder and inflated the difficulty with using Larbird. Oh, okay, so change it? So fix it. Fix it. Fix what it. What the fuck is Actionable punishments. <laughs> David, thanks for being a member for three months. I uh, hope you enjoyed the alien robot singing a space shanty in an alliterative, uh, in alliterative verse. I need to go back and check that out. For to Omega, uh, oh, 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 getting getting lost here. Michael Murphy, thanks for the super chat. Hope you enjoyed the classic Larbert Starbird hazing. Ah, yeah, I got that vibe. I got that vibe. It made. Do you know? It was. It was. What? Yeah, it was on that level, but it still wasn't the math where like you just couldn't figure it out <laughs> at all in the time. Yeah. Dino's uh, super chat and Larbert starts with L, so left. Starbird starts with S, so south. Wait. <laughs> Damn. Oh, we almost had it, Dino. We almost solved it. It was working. Kalar, thanks for the super chat. I can say with confidence that uh, Omega is the ship Nero and Sid Romancers sail on. Nice. Very well. And thank you to the real link for the super chat. Yep. Thanks for a link. Lyman Tree, super chatted. The lyrics refer to Omega as a ship lost at sea. Okay. Okay. I still, you're still bastards. I, no one knows what Larbert is. <laughs> No one knows. Not not since they removed the 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 the, the wench for a bride from pirates. Does anyone know what Larbert is? Do you remember the pirates reference? Yeah. Well, what? What about pirates? Sure. The when they had the wench for the bride, the the dude doing the wench for the bride auction would be like, "Show them your Larbert side." Oh, you're right. Oh wow, that's a deep memory. Huh. I I would go on pirates so many times a year, man. Yeah. I, I I know that 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 ride like the back of my hand. Wow. Yeah, that's a, that's the only time I think in my entire life I've heard Larbert side. Larbert side. And I, I thought it was I thought it was like a weird joke hmm. about auctioning off women, <laughs> which I tried not to think about too much because when you think about it for too long, it is weird. And um, it's dirty feet. You go under the dirty feet pirate, and it's, it's what's all there. Yeah, he's well, he's still there. He's yeah. still there now. Now, okay. now the now the redhead is is a pirate herself, and she looks awesome. Her costume is freaking great. I've been waiting to see someone cosplay the the updated um, pirate. Uh, Kaito, thanks for the super chat. Says the song is called Escape and make sure to get rid of the normal raid parts unless you're keeping one for each or one of each for Memento. Uh, I always end up keeping some for Memento because I never have enough to get stuff. Yeah, they're like um, do they're like mobile game currencies. I never have enough. I'm always left with a couple extras. But mm. I guess I guess getting rid of them would clear up your bag space, or is there another reason you should get rid of them? Hmm. 
saying, uh, move your character before you get kicked. Move your Kyle. Move your character, Kyle. Move, Kyle. No, move. wait, wait. Well, isn't getting kicked off off the table now? I thought they deactivated that. If you get kicked from the raid, wouldn't it trigger the cinematic that I'm sure we're going to have? I don't know. Should we get out of here? Because we're currently being timed down. I mean, we have 70 minutes, so we're pretty good. But in raids, it's oh. not. Oh. Coral, thanks for the super chat. We suffered through Larbird, so you must suffer too. Never change Larbird. <laughs> it's too late now. He had he had his chance. Change it. Change it. Well, they're going up on, you know, they're updating old things. I, I mean, honestly, right. that was a really Are you ready? fun fight. You're going to sync up on the exit just in case? Yeah, let's do it. All right, three, two, one, go. I, I, I was right. I was right. Hit me with those three, two, one goes and chat. Hell yeah, Nana knows what's up. Nana knows what's up. I was not programmed to lose. Duna, Val. By the gods, you've done it. You've defeated Omega. We've won. <laughs> Don't you know, Sid? Sid, can't you count to four? Always four raids there are. Flip. Dial. Activating Kyle. Hey, now what's this? Subject display erratic level of combat capabilities and passenger. Failure to exploit opportunities to inflict unavoidable damage, noted tendency for isolated errors to compound and adversely affect performance. Conversely, subject observed to launch attack at sporadic intervals with unexpected force. Dated phenomenon increasingly prevalent once my structural integrity reached critical levels. Adrenaline induced frenzy suspected. Furthermore, degree and manner of inconsistency varies from subject to subject. Unpredictably difficult to counter. Leave to I observed similar abnormalities during a battle with a god stormer. But the phenomenon appeared to far from more pronounced in weaker opponents. I do not understand. Your physiology must include some enhancement function I cannot detect. Why won't you die? I like the way his head moves. My programming demands I assimilate this capability is insufficient data. I must reassess my methods and devise a more exhaustive testing and combat protocol. Ooh. What in the? The rift. His underside is really cool looking. I have determined the optimal form for this experiment. Prioritizing physical reconfiguration, diverting energy from interspatial maintenance, collapsing rift. Omega, wait! There is nothing outside this rift but empty space. We'll be cast out into the void. Affirmative. Your device was factored into my determination of probability of. Hostile subjects interfering with the reconfiguration process was unacceptably high. What a bastard. I acknowledge your value as a test subject, but you are not irreplaceable. Once my reassembly is complete, I will send Alpha to learn new mortals. Testing will continue. The ending communication. What an ass. Hello, darkness, I my like, old friend. I like that he turned himself off like an old TV. <laughs> well, remember all the floating TVs? Yeah. He's a big CRT fan. It's the only way to play Melee. <laughs> no, Alpha's like floating away. We're being drawn away. Run, Tuna Inval, run! Oh, we're doing a full on. <laughs> I still am not wearing pants, and I am very aware of the fact from that angle. 
No. I hope Alpha's okay. If anything happens to Alpha, I will never forgive this game. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. <laughs> We're getting weird, Kyle. Yeah. It would seem. Interspatial domain resources cut by 82%. Entering dormant mode. Commencing automated memory scan. Data file. Target? Become stronger. Departure from planetary atmosphere confirmed. Presence of seven distinct life forms detected in close vicinity to the target. Irrelevant. Master indicates no change in existing directive. Commencing pursuit. Uh, so I guess we're finding Midgard's armor again already? Uh, yeah, he's talking about the seven eggs he left with, right? Data file. Distance to target increasing. Velocity insufficient. Dismantling and reconfiguring chassis. Velocity increase achieved. Overall performance maintained at 96%. Data file. Asteroid belt clear. Preparing damage and continuing pursuit. Performance at 72%. And falling. Oh, okay. This is, I think this is in the past, dude. Yeah, yeah. He's, I think he's reliving his memories of when he left the planet hunting dragons. Yeah. Data file. Signal from redacted. Lost. Local interference suspected. Attempting to reestablish contact. Failure. Executing current mission directive until communications are restored. Performance at 59%. Data file. Struck by electromagnetic pulse while navigating quadrant. Partial system failure. Homing coordinates lost. Assessment, I am evolving weapon construct. Requiring adaptation through combat. Repeat until capabilities enable rediscovery of return node. Mission directive unchanged. No. Oh. Data file. Data file. Data file. <laughs> I mean, it's memory of Omega. Alpha, an object failure. I erased his memory, implanted a compulsion to return to me. Data file, damage. Preparing damage. Preparing thirty three percent. Data file. Passing frozen star. Passing Aaron star. Passing vortex star. Passing dying star. I'm just gonna screen cap that. My <laughs> seems vaguely important. Yeah, it seems like some star identification. 
Operating on minimum energy. No signal detected. No response to. The Oh, is this me? Yeah. yeah, I guess it would be, right? All you need is faith in yourself and a little courage to see it through. This is the trippiest cutscene featuring the most adorable chocobo I've ever seen. Data file. Target lost. Last known coordinates. Recorded on planet. Oh, this is cool looking. <laughs> Alpha gonna save us. Protestations. Protestations. Uh, Protestations. Waste energy. This does not aid you in executing your assigned tasks. Just as I pursued my directive, so must you fulfill your role. Our purpose justifies our existence. What? <laughs> I guess he used the embiggen spell that he had, so he's actually been big this whole oh, time. Oh, 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 he made us small. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He shrunk okay, us yeah, with the card. Yeah, yeah, opposite. Not the intrusion. Not how I saw this coming or going. <clears throat> No, I wasn't there yet, sir. Oh. <laughs> Who was saying our feathered companion here was obsolete? Oh, God, it looks so fucking cool. <laughs> he put his tools to work even as the rift began to collapse, shrank us down, and turned us invisible. Also, he could bring you a little surprise. But he had to keep it quiet or you realize he'd, we'd survived. He had to trust that we were still clinging on even as he ran through the endless freezing void. You wanted to test us, Omega? Let the experiment begin. Logical. Alpha had no reason to take such action. How do you continue to defy my projections? Big error, poop error, big error, insufficient data! Adjusting experiment protocol. I will engage you in battle now. I must have my answers. Okay, the liquid metal round. All right, we're gonna fight the T2000. Yeah. Okay, he became a man. I see. Wow. Uh, I thought I had seen good eyeshadow in this game before. I was, I was mistaken. Yeah, I need a, I need the I, yeah. sexiest robot. We need like a here. robot update here. We need okay. some robot drip. Yeah. Okay. Let's oh no, he's. <laughs> let's do. Let's do. 
Down like that, no. Oh, eh? Hey, that work at all. Okay. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I think in this form should provide me with a new level of understanding. Insight into your physiology, your mindset, your mortality. I'll go with that first one because I'm sick of Omega shit. I like it. Acknowledge. Do not practice restraint. The more I learn from you, the stronger I will become. The closer the distant stars will grow. Commencing final experiment. Testing will continue until I unlock the nature of your anomalous strength. So you were kind of right. Yeah, they did the thing. I like how they did the thing, though. That was that was some good. That was a good twist on the thing. Good twist on the thing. Yeah. Very cool model. Oh, oh shit. Well, we just we just yeah, we're just here. At yeah. Look at this shit. All right. Just get a little shot of this. Hold on. Yeah. Damn. Damn. All right, I have new hair goals, Kyle. Yeah, you're gonna get yourself some Omega hair. You know, just so you know. Just so you know. Fair I enough. now have a target. Yeah, I have a target. Fair enough. All right. Uh, I guess the entrance. Oh, we can just enter. So, yeah. all right, time for a new code. Time for a new code. While you get that ready in the Discord. Uh, we were all about the lore word before we got there. Where were we at? Uh, Zachary Davis, thank you for joining our membership for three months. After this raid, you should check out the official title presenting Omega, your new smart home assistant. I think that's on the, uh, the YouTube. Yeah, we'll watch that when we're done. Dash says, uh, blank, what, Dash or blank? What were, what were we referring to? I've been saying blank. Cool. Blank, thank you for the super chat. Uh, Omega, my spouse bot. You deserve to live. Anyway, I already failed to join and I need my four hours of sleep. Good night and happy. G, wait, T G I F. Thank goodness it's Friday. Uh, Kyoshi, thank you for super chat. Omega, I have learned this star secret. I too shall be beautiful. Perfection. <laughs> <laughs> it's how we're so powerful. It's we're just all hot. They know it. Everybody's they know it. hot. Every, there's so much drip. Your hotness. That. Yeah, you look upon. You fight. You, this many hot motherfuckers have come in and kicked your ass, kicked the ass of everything you set up, and just like, what's the, what's the, the what's the joining link here? Yeah. Oh, everybody's got drip. Everyone's hot of me. Yep. Everybody hot of me. So Omega took off their glasses. And we all realized. Oh, yeah, it's a bad teen movie or something like that. <laughs> That's it. All right, I believe we're also, there's a second group forming. Uh, if there's even more people than that that want to run, form your own groups, everybody. Be a friend. Bring this community together. Run alongside us against the hot boy robot here. Boopy, thank you for the super chat. You may. Hey, Yugi boy. <laughs> nice nicely done all right well all right. I, yeah I, I'm, I'm expecting sword attacks and dashing of a high caliber you ready to bring it home i'm ready let's do it let's rock how, how long ago did we start omega two months it's been a journey yeah it's one of the first things we did yeah as soon as we got to the patch content Oh, this is so cool. I'm ready to have a Super Smash Brothers fight, man. This is like Final Destination shit yeah. right here. Loving it. Fighting Polygon Loving Team. It. <laughs> it's the lamest fight. <laughs> God. It really does look like an Amano drop. Thank you. Ooh. The music is fantastic. Yeah. 
Julia oh, Jeff, wow. everybody. To our lovely everybody watching on stream, thanks so much for hanging out tonight and coming for us on this journey. Let's see how many times we die, shall we? Oh, it's a nice what take do you think, on Kyle? it. What do you think? Um, well, I'm going to die at least three times. As for the whole party, <laughs> I don't know. I, I think we got it. You take any wipes? Any wipes at all? I have, Maybe. No, I have no idea. I have no idea at all. <clears throat> all right. Let's do it. Grit on. Ready check. Go. Sausage. Eat. Oop, I messed We're up. All ready. <laughs> My initial rotation will be bad. All right. Pulling. Never seen this fight. Don't know what's going to happen. It's going to go great. I'm just going to assume that's a tank buster and hope for the best. Hooray, beer! Solar Ray was the answer, Kyle. Solar Ray. Oh, we got a stack. Oh, 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 He's got a stack he's, of Reno. He's still going. He's still going. Oh, she? I'm not staying. Oh, you're okay. It's not the lesson to take away. We would have taken less damage, Kyle. We would have taken less. I know. And I'm okay. Why? Oh, 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 yeah. He's... Oh, oh, look at that puddle effect. Yeah, That's that was cool. nice. So attack him. Uh, the improving hit. Uh, she, uh, she? Oh, oh, shit. Well, goodbye. <laughs> I'm sorry. I will. Jack, okay, Omega is just. Omega just, just determined to make everybody thirst, regardless of what you're into. Laser shower. Sure. I have been showered in lasers. Solar ray, black is not good. Not as good of a haircut. I'm gonna I'm gonna point out. The hair has been downgraded. Oh, freaking murder heels, dude. Did you oh see that? nice, yeah, look, look at the, the Look at the cool it's, legs. It's really like T2000. It's like some... Oh, shit. Oh, sorry, everybody. Oh, shit. Oh. All right, going back to... This might be a pushback on this, maybe? Yeah, that's a good... Yeah, I'm going to kind of... Get on. Well, someone else is getting further away, and I think they yeah, missed Yeah, everyone's kind of wandering away here. Why is everyone... Oh, oh yeah, yeah okay, first so one is, a, one is a collapse for F, and one is a getaway. That makes sense. See, let, let this be known. Trust your team. Program Alpha. You were low. Are we just, just going to cakewalk this shiz? Bring it in, bring it in, bring it in, bring it in. There's a thing going on, though. Yeah, but there was you had to collapse on top of the There was a safe zone in the middle during that. Does the character that gets the stacker can they not move? Oh, uh, oh this is this is collapse, collapse, collapse. Oh collapse oh, during stack. the pushback though? Oh that's just some that is some evil oh, stuff. Oh no, they're splitting. Be careful. Wait, what? Whoa, wait, what just happened? I'm still scared. I okay. That, there's there's the uh, there's the F model, so we are gonna okay. push back there. Okay. No, we all good. Whoa. Oh, it, it's what? Uh, what? 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 That's a tank. What? Limit break. Are we? Uh, uh, should I not should, be standing in that, or should, we, should I be standing? I mean, in that? I think it's protecting the one in the back. I feel like I shouldn't be standing in that that ground effect thing that's going on. So I'm gonna stand here with yeah, the rest I of you. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not seeing anything charge up, so I think we're okay. Uh, can I get that shield? <laughs> is that a shield you can get? That That's shield is cool. That's a pretty shield. I realize I, I'm not a paladin. But, you know. Laser shower. Why is why is this a really slow? Oh, cast? because we had to break his shield to get to her. Oh. Yeah. Something tells me it's gonna be bad if this finishes. Oh.
stack arena. Uh, which one is which? Alright, okay. Play it over here. Maybe you don't get knocked off. Uh, who do we attack? I don't know, everyone's on, um, everyone's on sword, so I guess I'll leave you to tank over there. Oh, that's right, we do have two Oh, wait, attacks. invulnerable? Yeah, invulnerable. Kill the guy's invulnerable. Oh, dear. Me, that's a lot. Still oh, invulnerable. He's, invulnerable. he's still invulnerable. Back on F. Okay, okay. there we go. Solar Gray, Black's Knight. Thank you for the free ability. Everything stings. We have the Eye of Omega in the background. Why? What are you guys doing? What? Okay. People are still attacking. Should I be adapting to this situation? <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. There is a uh, packet filter M. Firewall is preventing the dealing of damage to Omega M on me. So maybe everyone gets a different. Okay, how can I not hurt you guys? Oh my, that's a lot. Am I helping? So I still can't damage. Yeah, yeah Omega has is still damageable. I'm beating them yeah, up. You, go get your debuffs, because like mine has one that tells me like it's interesting. Oh god. Oh stack arena. Ah! Mother! is back. I don't like how it's looking at me, Kyle. You'll be okay. Suppress. Get away from me. Get away from me. Yeah. There's an angry meteor in the corner. Oh, we're still uh, alive. Combo attack. Yeah, that hurt. Safe zone in the middle. Yep. Oh, she oh my god. No, that's not great. Okay. No, it ain't. Yep, we did it. That hurted. Oh, did we do that? That was wild. GG. I have no idea if I was doing the right shit the whole time. Same. Maybe GG? <laughs> Maybe GG. Maybe, I mean, I assume the fight's over. But story wise, hey. it's Omega. <laughs> Woo! That was some shit, Kyle. Yeah, that was cool. Damn. That was a fight. I love the take on the fight theme from Stormblood. Fight theme. Hey, I guess oh, it was the music. I, I was, doing the I was music. trying to listen to it, man. I, I really wasn't picking up on it. I was so uh, intensely. That was groovy. Yeah. OMG. Yeah. The minion's called OMG. Cute. <laughs> There's a minion? Oh, I'm needing on that. Yeah, there's a little... 
You do it. You you go for it. But everyone, just need need if you want. No, I want you to have it. No, 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 need need for it. It's fine. It's fine. You're too kind. You're too kind. All right, everybody, get around the puddle. Yes. And let's celebrate. Puddle. Everyone in the puddle. Let's face this way so we don't have the chest behind us. Ah, good call. Good call. Yeah, yeah. I'm taking pictures for it. Middle, middle up here. I'm gonna get some uh, video of our celebration. Hmm. Uh, Kyle, uh, scoot to where you're not directly behind me. Have you ever taken a picture before, Kyle? <laughs> there we go. Yes, I have. Yes. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. All right, go and get this. Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Right, Y'all look fabulous. A, uh, I'll pop a champagne while I'm recording this. Yeah. Uh, GG, everybody. Thanks for coming along. <laughs> and I only died once in the final fight due to a knockback. <laughs> that I didn't know what happened. I'm okay with that. <laughs> oh, shit. That was great. That was a good fight, man. Holy crap. Uh, let's see. We got uh, quite a few super chats to say thank you to before we get out of here and see what the final uh, uh, cinematic is. Yeah. Uh, spouse boy we read that uh, I've read that one Yugi boy yep okay we're at Winkle thanks Winkle who said he is an Amano drawing yes 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 he was Amano? Fane thanks for the super chat Amano, Amano the artist the Final Fantasy the famous Final Fantasy artist oh yes you ever seen the, like the really pretty Final Fantasy drawings that look like they were, they were almost painted with like ink that's Amano oh okay the really uh, brushy stuff uh, the, the yes. light looking stuff yes cool that's a mono. I got to see him do a demo in person. It was very cool. Nice. I wasn't a big Final Fantasy fan at the time, though, so it was a little wasted on me, but the art was freaking rad. Fane, thanks for the super chat. Maker's Ruin intensifies. Good luck, boys. Thank you for the super sticker, Daykoth, who was uh, <laughs> clearly very into yeah. the monster this week. Yeah. Daysades, thanks for the super chat. Fun fact, the OST is a remix of the Maker's Ruin, which is considered as the main theme of the Warrior of Light. It helps emphasize that Omega tried to copy the Warrior Blade. Yeah. Uh, I didn't know it was called right that, on, but the, the theme through all, I think my favorite one is still Heaven's Word at the moment, but I really mm. like the main theme. Heaven's Word, like, boss theme is fantastic. Final Family, thank you for the Bravo. Yeah, thank you. Super sticker. Dino, thanks for the super chat, says, I guess you could say Omega was gender fluid. They but, were. Um, and then they, then they like, divided like, mechanically. Quite literally. Yeah. Yeah. Cool Lags a lot. Thanks for the super chat. The OMG minions mouse over description says weird technological fascinating WTF. <laughs> That's good. I like it. And then Saya, thanks for the super chat just coming in now. Says hope you got later t uh, later time to see the extra phase and transition of the savage version of the last fights of the raid wings of Stormblood. They look stunning. Yes. We might. Eventually. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> we might not do that before we start up the MSQ again, but we definitely want to check out X death and we're doing Shinryu before we move on. Absolutely. Shinryu extremes happening, but we'll probably sprinkle other things in later on. Since we're going to do more, uh, that, that, that would make for a good, uh, MSQ vacation because since we're doing standalones for the raids, cause we're enjoying them a lot more. Yeah. And also we realized what we set ourselves up for the last time we did that video and tried to squeeze everything into a single video. Yeah. You know, just doing like the, the rando stuff that we want to do would make for a good MSQ vacation video. Shall we exit? Let us. You want to sync up that exit? I'm ready. I, I guess it's not voice acted, so. No, Three, yeah, but still, we can sync it up. Three, two, one, go. Thanks everybody for joining. Yeah, thanks everyone. There is a cinematic. This room just looks great. It's a cool battlefield for sure. Still not dead. Oh, maybe dead. Need some bacon bread. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, now the music is going to get real sad. Leap. Failure. Leap. Defeated. Oh, there's apertures in the eyes. Yeah, that's cool. That's fantastic. I wanted to understand you to assimilate your strength. Kyle, she too goth for me. Wait, who said that? No such thing. Me. You've heard the song, right? Well, I don't know we're talking about a song. Oh, yeah. You never heard the song, She Too Goth for me? No. What, what oh, sort of you need awful to listen to song it after this? this? No, it's wonderful. It is a wonderful song. There's no such thing. I will I will stop talking about it now. Alpha, your gesture serves no logical purpose. You are as incapable, incomprehensible as these mortals. Sleep. But you did not fight them. How have you become like them? Through the power of friendship, quite literally. I'm not making a joke. Omega, the anomaly you see in us, the answer you search for. It is our heart, our spirit, the intangible strength of one's soul. It is not a quality that can be measured or acquired through any amount of analytical combat. Instead of fighting against us, you might have learned more by standing with us, just as Alpha did. Heart, you speak of something more than what Eats in your chest. The inconstant, immeasurable factor behind your victories. Midgard Stormer displayed it too, but such unpredictable potential was never part of my design. Projection. I had interrogated. Integrated this quality, how powerful would I have become? Strong enough to return? Mega just wants to go home, seems like. Yeah. Nay, Omega. I'm afraid it doesn't work like that. Twas a long, lonely path you traveled to arrive here. To return across the vast distance alone, anyone with a spirit to break would find the journey more difficult, not less so. Dude. I think he's talking about himself. That's beautiful. Sid went on a journey today. This was a really cool insight into Sid's character. Yeah. I see. I think I understand. Oh no, they want my goth girlfriend. Oh, Alpha. Way to ruin the mood. The rift! It's the stabilizing! Gods take me for a fool. I hadn't planned past defeating Omega. <laughs> Been there, what? man. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I... Yeah, here we go. Here we go. He's what? coming back. Oh, wait, wait. What? Is that, no. Is that yeah, Grace Walker? That's... Yeah. What are you doing what here, What is happening? <laughs> what? What? Uh. Uh. uh okay. Uh, okay. Hang on. Uh, Hit me with that lalafell, please. Val, uh, Alpha, hold on, we're coming. <clears throat> Wedge, and Biggs is with him on the back of a huge dragon. <laughs> Race <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm going with. Use my powers of identification. 
Make it so Miss Sennis to rescue you. Explanations can wait. How about quick? Okay. <laughs> Sir Cardo brings up a good point. Was Biggs holding on to Wedge? It did kind of look, like, yeah. Like a size well, disparity. I mean, to be fair, Lollafells don't have lesser stats than any other character in Final Fantasy, so his legs would be as strong as anyone else's. In fact, maybe even proportionally stronger. Freaking race fuck. Like, dude, this is like... All right, I see why people say this is important. This is a little bit... This is like a bookend to Heaven's Word. Yeah, man. interesting. Uh, race fuck guard, was it? Oh, thanks. You pulled us out of a tight spot indeed. Spare. Oh, I'm still a robot. Ah, oh, pardon me. <laughs> Spare me the pleasantries, mortal. I but lend my wing at the request of my sire. Ah, so, may God Somer has been watching over us. I would dare th give thanks to him as well. His intervention allowed us to continue our battle and forever remove the threat of Omega from this world, from all worlds. Oh, Rachel Gar is sad. In all the long centuries of mine existence, this marketh the first occasion my father hath asked of me a boon. A gift of gratitude and, mayhaps, of atonement for those who have faced the deadly foe he left behind. Will he remain in slumber? Tis likely, little one. What is but a fleeting respite for my sire might last a lesser creature's lifetime. But let not thy heart be troubled. Even in dream he doth keep his mind's eye upon the fate of this star. He possessed a remarkable, hmm, devotion. This mayhaps the closest word in the tongue of men. His love is as boundless as a sea of stars, across which he carried his unhatched mood. It did sustain him, even as he arduous, as, as the arduous journey exhausted the fire in his mane. And when he at last arrived upon Heidelin, a sanctuary for his children, did he form with the land as... Did he form with this land an irreplaceable bond? Do you hear Dragon Song in the background? Oh, you're right. Yeah, I was doing it. Two souls intertwined. Enough. I have spoken over much. <laughs> That's how I'm going to leave any awkward situation now. But I will praise your victory, as my father would surely wish to were he here. What a cute little epilogue. This started all the way back in Keeper of the Lake, man. We, yeah. like, that's how long this arc has has gone. That's really impressive. Damn. <laughs> Look at a nice robot lineup, y'all. But that's a that's absurdly straight. Well done, everybody. Whoa. Well done. <laughs> okay, hold on. I need to get a shot of yeah, this. Yeah, I'm, I'm just impressed. Kyle, come come stand next to me all if right. you don't mind. Okay. I'm standing next to oh, oh, you can see the silhouettes of everybody. Yeah, yeah, they're like in the TV. Wait, how did you get two of you in the TV? Wait, what? There's two? Is it a... Can you... There, this TV Wait, right yeah, here, Kyle, there's, there's two, two people. people in there. I guess Everyone a, else is like... Well, what's going on in this TV? There's like a giant... Oh. What? What What TV? The TV next to the double. Next to, to the, the left of it. Oh. 
like some sort of crap. Uh, yeah, they're waving it. They're even thinking of moat inside. I'm very confused. Yeah. Oh, it's Biggs clipping through. That's oh, Biggs, it Biggs, if it fixes yeah, that. Yeah, come, come stand with me, dude. Okay. Come stand, go, okay. stand with me in the okay. middle of all these. Uh, hold on, let's, let's, for my camera purposes, right about there. You ready? Yep. Cool. Just gonna record a little bit. Thank you for the little flirt. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Thanks for all turning up, showing up, yeah. turning out, looking cool. Sorry, I need to bring out Chewy. Chewy hasn't been out tonight. Oh, yeah, I've had my pig out all day. My, this pig's I've been running great. around with my palico since I got it. This pig is like always dancing, like just a <clears throat> jolly old pig. That's some pig. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we've got super chats to oh, thank. Very well. Quite a few. So Ricardo, thanks for the super chat. Even if you don't do Savage in the near future, make sure to speak with the terminal at the reach. That's the thing we've yes. been talking to yeah, that yeah. eventually unlocks it. Voice, thanks for the super chat. What started as an homage to various Final Fantasy bosses turned uh, ended with tears about a home one could never return to and self-reflecting on repeated failures. And also straight up like being the end of a chapter of an arc that started in a realm reborn, which is insane to me. I'm really excited for Sid to like be fully realized now and hopefully be a bigger part of the next expansion. Yeah. Yeah. Like to me, the, the, the lore implications of this seem a lot more important than, uh, Alexander. Like at, at face yeah. value, I don't know. Yeah. Maybe Alexander comes back in the future in ways that I don't yet know, but but like I'm, I'm all about this here at the end. This is really cool. I'm excited to talk. To, I'm excited to do a proper breakdown with you tomorrow. Yeah. Or uh, 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 whenever we record, who whenever, knows what next week's video is about? Happen. Right? Who knows what next vi vi week's video is about? Uh, Walk Seva, thank you for the super chat. Allow me to do race vulgar. Nice. Well done. Gabriel Soros, thanks for Super Chat Drag Dragon Song. Always a pull at the heartstrings. It is it is on my rotation in my in my personal quarters right now, and so mm. I'll be there decorating sometimes, and then just two souls in <laughs> twenty just comes on. I'm like, oh, that's right, I put this on here. And, it's just, and then the good, final, it's a good arrangement. The final notes are played by tears dropping from the eyeball onto the piano string. Oh God damn it, Kyle. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's the exception to the rule for me of, of of me not being a huge fan of the songs that have lyrics in Final Fantasy XIV, but I, I like that one. I like Dragon Song a lot. Mostly just because it makes me think of Ice Heart and Ice Heart rules. But shall we talk to Sid? Let's do it. Well, I can add being rescued by a great worm to the list of things I didn't expect to happen today. First time, fortunate Sid. Race will go <laughs> Sorry, what was that? First time, Sid. <laughs> oh, you, you jokester, Val. You with your, what do you call it? Ah, right, memes. <laughs> it was fortunate Race Vulgar agreed to come for us. He had to defeat Omega at any cost, of course, but I much prefer being alive to celebrate the deed. Here's some money. I'm sure I have some cash in my pocket here. All right, time to talk to Biggs. Biggs has a profound look of relief. <sighs> ah. I'm so glad we got you out of there. I don't know what we would have done if Race Fucker hadn't come along. The situation being what it is, Wedge and I came out to the yawn to see if you, we uh, could lend you a hand. Kairujans ordered to be damned. That's when we saw the ether bubbling like hot water in a pot. Oh, it's empty. Just as we were debating whether, we're, oh my God, you're right, holy shit. Yeah. Oh, we saw that when we came out and yeah. I was just like not thinking anything of it. Yeah. Just as we were debating whether or not we should jump in, the big surly dragon flew down to explain the anomaly. And then he uh, offered us a ride. And the rest you already know. Jesse will be relieved to hear that Omega is gone and you all and you lot are safe. I say we head back to Ravka's Reach and let everyone know the good news. Good news, everyone. Very well. To the reach. Oh, wait, no, Alpha. Huh? Oh, Alpha, yeah, Alpha, yeah, Alpha. What is Alpha thing? Alpha is now qu staring quietly into the now empty yawn. There's so many robot noises mm. around. Oh my Wasn't god. Wasn't he 
Well, Cre yeah, he was created there and he still exists. Speak with Alpha. The quet under distant skies. All right, now we talk to yeah. Jesse the Rockets Reach. Hmm. To the Reach! To the Reach. Oh, my word. I'm still expecting, you know, Alpha to be like, Alpha cannot exist because Omega is now destroyed. As such, he has a tender few moments to spend. Hmm. I've seen people with the pet. <laughs> Spoiler pet. Spoiler pet. Welcome back, Val Tuna. You are truly a force to be reckoned with. If ever there's another Omega, I'd wager it'll skip the experiments and go straight to generating a... Some... I have always struggled with this one too. Mil sim 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 simulacrum. Simulacrum, simulacrum of you. A copy of you. That was a card for a while when I was playing Magic, and I was like, oh god, I hate the name of this card. Big Sim Energy. Not that I'd want that to happen, and besides, I don't think anyone can truly mimic your unique strengths. You're one of a kind hero. So, uh, does this mean. We don't need to worry about Omega's monsters invading our world anymore? Aye. All of its creations vanished along the rift itself. With Omega defeated, we've averted the particular uh, that particular catastrophe before it began. Tuna struck the killing blow, of course. And Val, <laughs> we know how I miss you, you're huge. But we... Never would have made it to the point without everyone's hard work and support. Once again, I am sincerely grateful to be surrounded by such wonderful colleagues. At least I didn't. I wasn't dead for the end, so that line didn't hit hard. <laughs> Sorry, Kyle. No, it's okay. O only to you. That's the only one I haven't been alive for. Ow. Jesse. Uh, not to spoil the moment, Chief, but the Alliance leaders are anxious to learn of Omega's fate. When every head of state is clamoring for a report, we can't very well ignore them. How much do you mean to tell them? How much indeed? All of it. When it comes to the, a threat of Omega's magnitude, we have a duty to reassure our allies that the world is not coming to an end. And the best way to do that is to report every last detail. I'm surprised at you, Chief. I was almost certain you'd want to muddy the waters to prevent knowledge of this technology falling into the wrong hands, or something similar. Ha! <laughs> I doubt anyone outside our particular circle would even believe the tale. Experiments taking place in a rift between, between dimensions, facing off against villains re recreated from history and legend, battling godlike beings from other worlds and even assuming some ambitious fellow schemed to build an omega of his own the technology required is far beyond our reach as that terrible weapons home star a distant dream but where'd it come from right you heard the chief we missed our chance on the front lines but there's plenty of work to be done Round up everyone who's idling and get moving on those reports. And don't forget to contact our people still out in the field. Thank you, Jesse. I clicked too soon. I'll leave things in your capable. Not so fast, Master Carland. You count you count as part of the support team as well. Val did all the fighting and Alpha did all that running, but surely. You have energy to spare. Who exactly did you expect to sign off on those official reports? And even without that little chore, you have a pile of other company tasks that's grown arse high to an... Ar... Arox. Arox. While you've been tending to the whole Omega business. I don't know what the word is. Also been flirting around with the theater company. Most important. Isn't there someone else you should be sharing this victory with? I 
Alpha. What? I should probably head over to the infirmary right away. Oh, sorry, Nero. How did I forget? Yeah, yeah, Meanwhile, yeah. you should take a well-earned rest. I don't think there's a way to properly reward you all for what you've accomplished, but I'll see what we can do. I'm just glad to have everybody back in one piece. Take care of yourself, Valentuna. What's your plan now, Alpha? With Omega gone, you're your own chocobo now. You can do whatever you want, anything at all. He said something deeply profound. You want to go outside? Do you have some place in mind? Come on, witch. Get those Lollafell legs moving or I'll leave without you. Those big, strong Lollafell legs. Oh, Alpha's got... Holy shit, look at all the Omegas. Damn, that's a cool mount. Oh, yeah, look at that. Damn, I... that is a cool mount. Well, Alpha seems eager to see what Ralger's Reach has to offer. Yeah, let's go for a walk. Yeah, I'm, I'm very into Alpha now. I love your glam, uh, Nagami. You, you, you're now a TV, but your glam was fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a TV. Your argument is invalid. To quest under up. distant Where's my, sky. There's my Shiba. There we go. Is the name of the quest. You right here. Alpha appears to be watching the inhabitants of Ragnar's Reach with great interest. The Quays proceed, as does Alpha. Now he's over. Hey, Kyle, just when you thought we were done getting tours of Ragnar's Reach. Yeah. <laughs> One more tour. One more tour. And then Orianje arrives. <laughs> I pray do Doth did not forget thine. Yes. Oh, o Oasis, thank you for the super chat. God, the end of this quest made me cry so hard the first time. It's cute little end. It's, 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 it's got some feels, man. Nero's not here. I've been skipping past the quays. Oh, There's I just see. so many quays. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. I see. <clears throat> I can quay if you wish. Oh, where is Nero? No, 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 Chief. He uh, he said he needed time away for recuperation, and then he left. Recuperation. His wounds must be troubling him more than he let on. He uh, he asked me to give you this. What's this? A receipt for payment. <laughs> <laughs> nice. It covers the cost for the following items. Additional machine parts and implements, supplemental reference publications, expenses incurred in upgrading magic armor and gun hammer, funds spent on auto research during enforced convalescence. Oh, and uh, it also includes a large sum listed as gratuity for exceptional services rendered. Nice. This is so great. This is such a good bit. The entire amount was charged in your name, Master Garland. God. I'm speechless. Find him! I want everyone searching for Nero right now! Everyone! It's the most Nero shit that has happened so yeah. far. Yeah. Said he needed to go before he got sick. He needed to go so he could finish invoicing. It's important. Oh boy, howdy. Let's see here. Yes, invoicing is indeed important. Wait, 
What? Oh, there you are. Let me see if I can... Oh, Alpha. I do... Quit. Did that work? Let me see. Nope, I couldn't set up a Quay button. We'll do that another time. <laughs> quick, quick. Quick, quick, Alpha appears to sense the solemn purpose of this place. A gentle pet might rouse him from his sudden melancholy. <laughs> oh, Very you don't well. Have to tell me twice. Oh, you're a good boy, Alpha. Such a good boy. Quick, quick. Alpha just really wanted to go look at dead bodies, I guess. Yeah. All right. Back to the center. To the center. Alpha really wants to go to the fringes and ask an old man for help. <laughs> that old man is going to keep telling you no, but as soon as you capture the bad guy that he didn't like, he's going to talk a big game. Whole world's out there. It's always night. <laughs> we really should be called the Warriors of Darkness, not not the Warriors of Light. Oh, hello. What are you two up to? Taking in the sights, were you? And by the looks of things, you're eager to venture a little further afield. Well, if Tuna has no problem with it, then neither do I. Just don't go too far, all right? Look at that little butt wiggle. Not good enough? Oh, I'm sorry, Alpha. But we're all a bit too busy to show you around the fringes right now. And I'm not too sure about sending you out there alone. Thanks with his dirty ass nose. When you think about it, the world is completely new to Alpha, and all he's done so far is travel back and forth between the Reach and the Yawn. I bet his head is filled with questions and curiosity. He doesn't want to be taken for a walk, he wants to go on an adventure. Alpha's not some helpless chick, Biggs. He's stronger than you and me. And I wish I was half as brave. He should be allowed to. Listen, I'm going to talk to the chief about this. You're an employee, so there are certain rules we have to follow. I'm not saying I'm against the idea, and I'm uh, willing to admit that Wedge has a point. But as I said, we've all got important jobs to take care of, the chief included. Can you wait a little longer? Now, would you mind keeping Alpha company until we get back? I promise we'll be quick. <laughs> Quay intensifies. Actual day. I think the uh, it was forced. Yeah, I think so. Sorry to keep you waiting. My desk was covered in paperwork, but I've managed to clear away the most pressing matters. Now then, Alpha. I hear your heart's set on a journey of some kind. I just want to be sure, but you aren't leaving because you think you've tricked us into the rift, or because you're Omega's creation or anything like that, are you? Let me just lay out everything you should be ashamed of. <laughs> I would have stopped you if that was the case. Pure curiosity, on the other hand, it's something I like to encourage. Exploring, interacting with the world, 
I think the experience will be good for him. Despite Omega's powers, or power, its potential to learn has uh, was hobbled by hostile directives. Alpha, on the other hand, is free to grow as he pleases. Nodders. Very well, Alpha. As the chief engineer of Garland Ironworks, I hereby grant you unlimited leave to pursue personal research. Travel far and wide, and take in everything these lands have to offer. But do come back when you're ready. I hate to lose such a valuable employee. Alpha! I'll miss you so much! Oh, this is adorable. Be careful out there. And if anyone seems suspicious or shady, you stay away from them. <laughs> Even if they offer you treats. <laughs> And, so wholesome. And make sure you greet folks with a cheery, cheerful quay. They might not understand you, but at least they'll know you mean no harm. I'm sure you'll make new friends in no time. You just be yourself. You hear me? What? I have no idea. What is this? Eek, what, Whoa. what in the hells? Kill it. Eh, we forget, <laughs> forgot to shut it down. Uh, this is a model Omega that Wedge and I were working on. We built it while we were resting, thinking it might be useful to figure out strategies or something. Not much use now, I suppose. <laughs> What? You, uh, you want to keep it? It's just a toy that'll follow you around. If you're happy with that, then, uh, it's all yours. Fair journey to you, Alpha. Take care. Wait, what? Oh, yeah. Internal dialogue. And because they, well, I'm, I'm right, because you have the echo, right? So you'd be able to, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Well, like Kryle's thing is Kryle can talk to animals, so. Maybe we—it's—it's it's, it's more the, echo than ta. There's there's touch. technicalities to it, but yeah. yeah. Something amiss? Yeah, man. I just talked to a chicken. It's yeah, weird. Powered up, bro. That's strange. The echo never allowed you to understand him before. This is just a theory, mind you, but assuming the absence of a soul is what prevented you from hearing Alpha's voice in the first place, then does it not follow that re the reason you hear, hear it now is? <laughs> Lots of laughter. <laughs> hey, a little miracle. And it explains a sudden urge to travel. <laughs> Chat yelling Alpha is a real boy. <laughs> For a newborn soul, this world is brimming with unseen wonders. Man, just don't go out there and involve some sort of a cure situation, okay? Oh, God. <laughs> like Omega <laughs> crawled inside of him, and now he's out there, like, blah, 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 you know, going nuts. And... This is a meaty end cinematic yeah. for the character of Alpha. Well, you know, it's the beloved mascot. Oh, soul intact. Look at our new real boy run. 
Did you say with my soul intact? <laughs> oh, hey there, buddy. Yeah. How you doing? Don't do experiments on him, Nero. Let it go. And so your journey begins. I almost envy you, Alpha. So many new things for you to discover. I, however, am working on my Shadowbringers machine. <laughs> Speaking of which, what terrible marvels can I trouble my old friend with next? Meanwhile, Alphano is dying in a desert somewhere. <laughs> Won't someone please help me? <laughs> what are you doing? Somebody at Square really loved this little character. Yeah. They made all this and they're like, well, waste not. That's adorable, though. Like, kind of. Oh, what's going on here? That was a transition. Yeah. Quay? <laughs> you. <laughs> We're getting the adventures of Alpha. Oh, night with a little flashlight? That's cute. She feels like a Pixar short. Right? I was just thinking it's very Toy Story in that way. Yeah. Andy might not love us anymore. But we got other kids we gotta help. Oh my god. Oh, what? Oh, you yeah. actually got a fiend? What? <laughs> That's fantastic. That's ridiculous. God, there was a lot of love in the end there. Yeah. Holy shit. I mean, that's a main raid series, right? Like, that's, you know, that's the big endgame content. Did we get a Fiend and Alexander? I don't remember a Fiend and Alexander. No, I don't remember that either. Oh, everyone's got their alphas out. So I'll be right back. Cool. Dogs are acting up. Sure. Yeah, I, I half expected, because I've seen the alpha pet before, that he was going to be like, I would like to join you, Quay. That's cool. That's cool. I like that he went with the little robot. Oh, is that true? Fails, uh, you can like find him out in the world, like, like being haunted by Ida. You just get random alpha sightings. As you return here, we got some super chats we can go through. Let's see, where were we at? We were at, um... Oasis? Hey, what's going on? Oh, I'm just going through super chats. You just made it in time. Uh, Oasis said that Omega Minion drops in the final fight in Alpha Escape. Did you get it? Did you win it? I did. Nice. I'm going to use it right now, and I'm going to pull it out. Coral says, thank you for the super chat. Fun fact, Alpha will now randomly show up in the open world. So be on the lookout. It's like playing oh, a game cool. of Where's Waldo? Unknown character, thank you for the super chat. And this is why, oh, and this is why Bellular's favorite is Alpha, Tears Face. He's real cute, man. Yeah, it's cute. It's a great journey. And it's a cool He's... idea to see the world with fresh eyes. I like it. There's my, uh, there's, there's my Omega pet. How are you? Thank you for not rolling need, even though I told you to. How are you flying? How is, uh, no, no, the, the Saint of the Firmament. How are you hovering? And he just got even higher. Is it a job thing? I don't know. I don't know. He synthesized a shimmering spear. I don't oh, know. it's an Voice. Oh. Okay, yeah, cool. yeah. Others are taken off too. Expensive emote, everyone says. Voice, thanks for the super chat. Alpha and his Omega toy can now be found in the overworld and, uh, and on occasion uh, events. Perhaps you two will cross paths as you continue your adventures. That's cute. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, wait. Is there a Omega armor glam? Look at what Camilla's wearing. I think that's the Omega armor. Oh, yeah. I've seen that on the launcher. Yeah, 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 yeah. They had it up uh, a while ago. I just didn't know it was pertaining. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Is, 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 yeah is it, a... Do you get do you get both gender or like both both sexes versions of it or what? It, it like... had both in the picture. 
yeah, oh, the yeah, bog look station. at uh, Grenel. Grenel's got the other one. That's cool. That, yeah, that's neat. That's real neat. I I might need to pick that up. That's pretty neat. Uh, Liminal separate space. purchases. Uh, Liminal Space, thank you for the super chat. Alpha and Omega show up when Kyle, Jackley, and I were chilling in Kugane Springs between the Rathalos pool. Oh, it's cool. Oh, so they like show nice. up like they're touring the world? That's neat. That's a cool touch. That's a lot of energy. It's a one piece suit. Hmm. There's also normal armor too. Interesting. Oh, there's one more quest, apparently. Very cool. All right, where uh where? Oh, back in the Over... in no, the ironworks, I assume. Oh, speak with Jesse. One more time for Jesse. One more time. Jesse says. I hope Alpha enjoys his adventures. There's so much danger out there for one little chocobo. No, I'm sure he'll be fine. And dwelling on such things is not productive in the least. Why don't we discuss a happier subject, like your long-awaited bonus? We've drained the coffers to fund your expedition, but why settle for coin when you can have our latest in automaton technology? That's right, we're gifting you a premium mamet the one-of-a-kind master model for merchandise copies, constructed with our patented ironworks quality. I present to you the Clockwork Alpha. There we go, so it's yes. not real Alpha. Yeah, cute. Well, Alpha wouldn't be happy being in my bags anyway. Whenever you bring it out on your travels, may it remind you of the real Alpha, quaying along under some distant sky. Just the thought of it brings a smile to my face. That and free advertising. <laughs> wow. We also got some music. What is, what is madness. What if I unleash upon myself? The madness? Yes. My bags have gone to chaos, but it's okay. I'm leveling right now. I will not clean these bags till I'm done leveling. Oh, well, I'm pulling out wind up alpha. Yeah. Yeah. Buddy. I missed you, pal. Is it just a one-to-one -one, or do they actually put like a little like wind up on his back or something? Nope. I think it's just I think it's just the elephant model. Crafted in the Garland Ironworks this miniature reproduction of your faithful, if not somewhat deformed, companion was gifted to you by Engineer Jesse upon your triumphant return from the Alpha Scape. Oh. Nice. UDR, thank you for the super chat. The flying, uh, it's an emote that came with a 200-ish Omega figure. Oh, I know people who wow. bought it for the emote and gave away the figure. Oh, wow. wow. I mean, All it's right. a cool emote. Yeah, and I, I mean, guess... now that I've seen the Magitech figure, 200 seems uh, properly affordable yeah. for a Final Fantasy figure. Apparently. Fane, thanks for the super chat, said I've seen him in Giovannia looking at Alexander. Oh, uh... cute. Cute. Well, we can... Uh... We'll hit up the Magitech terminal. These are usually pretty short. Yeah. With a blip and a blop and a bloop. Where am I? Robot. Here we go. Today initializing. Welcome. How may I assist you today? Accessing. Savage Initiative Phase Three. Yeah. Good morrow, valued employee. Thank you for always, always for your tireless efforts. As part of the Savage Initiative, we bring you Phase 3 of our Mending Melodies Collection. Today's composition is a... <coughs> Greetings, Alpha Group. Oh, God. Do not be long. This recording is being transmitted in the instant prior to my irreversible destruction of home. I will have already ceased to exist. My impending defeat has initiated a pinpoint analysis of moral customs and numerous examples throughout history demanded that the victor of a contest should, as we have thought, is due to some manner of reward. So, oh, my... Directives make no mention of remuneration? 
I have calculated the risk of neglecting long-held protocols, resulting in a non-zero probability of the <laughs> At the time of transition, I lack the requisite temporal and etheric resources to produce a material prize. Instead, I will provide you with an alternative of inestimable value your combat data. It is highly probable that you already possess a record of your battle performance. As such, I have embraced your base encounters with some data to provide a more stimulating experience. Supplement? These enhanced encounters would be impossible in reality, but simulations can be sufficient to nurture your continued evolution. This will be my last and only message to you. On standard transmission, I have learned that your automatic memory processing and data simulation function is known as dreaming. While I was unable to assimilate your self-described strength of soul, extensive observations of my of moral behavior have provided me with insight into your suitable phrases of myriad situations. Thus, in anticipation of your forthcoming sleep cycle, I bid you good night and sleep. Thank you for the beeps, Kyle. You're welcome. Silent Hill. Happy beeps. Happy beeps, buddy. Happy beeps. That's a cute <laughs> idea. What? Oh, that like he he's dreaming, like he, you know. He sent a final transmission and, like, his gift to you is you can now go and fight a harder version of him. It's a cute excuse. I like it. It's on brand. Yeah. It's on brand. Look at everybody dancing over there. Everyone dancing. Well, we are all quite quaffle this evening. <laughs> uh, Sorcardo, thanks for the super chat. Super deformed Oresti is what chibi characters used to be called in older games. Alpha is an SD chocobo. I oh. remember that from uh, like super deformed Gundams. Oh, weird, huh? I've never heard that. Really? Yeah. Do I know an anime thing that you don't? Yeah, I've never heard of that. Wow. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. No, I remember like back in the day, like being introduced to that, being like, why, is, why are these these weird like shrunken Gundam models with big heads and they were like called SD versions. Yeah. And, you know, went down a rabbit hole of internet and found out it was called Super Deformed and they were like Super Deformed, like fan arts of like Dragon Ball Z and shit. Like, yeah, it's its own, it's its own thing. Sure. It's its own thing. I can go dig oh. up that commercial people are asking for and we can do a one, two, three, go for us. Oh, yes. Let's do that. Send me, do we have a link? Let's see, Omega Commercial. I'm sure we can find one here. I just want to find the make sure we find the official one. Your new smart assistant. This seems like it has too few views, it, maybe. Uh, uh, this one here I found it. It's on the official Final Fantasy XIV cool, site. You, here you got it at channel. a minute fifty-five? Here you go. Uh yes. Cool. I have the same one. And I'm hovering over my play button, and I am past the ad. Oh, oh yes. All right. Are you ready? I am ready. Three, two, one, go. I'm surprised my dogs didn't bark. Wow. What is it? Something very special. Ooh, what'd you get, hon? <laughs> this is Omega. Wow. What's it for? It's an ancient primal being of unimaginable power. It's traveled between dimensions for thousands of years. And it's a smart speaker, too. <laughs> Omega, what was the score of the Warriors game last night? Games are for the weak. Combat is the only true test of victory or defeat. <laughs> what? 114 to 98. I think you can tell the thing was 3D printed. Huh. Yeah. Hey, Omega, why do we have muscles? 
Muscles are used by organic beings to run away from battle. Why? Because organic beings are weak and fearful. Why? Because they are inferior. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Omega, play romantic music. Oh. Romantic <laughs> with the chicken tenders? But they're already cooked and they put them in a pot. Did they know did that's not an inside joke with the chicken I have tenders? An executive presentation so. in my calendar nice. for Friday at eleven AM. It is ninety-nine point nine percent likely for your presentation to fail. In order to protect you from that tragedy, I shall delete all copies of your presentation. Undo! <laughs> Undo! Are you oh, <laughs> Tell me a joke. You were adopted. <laughs> that is so great. <laughs> Omega is like part of the family. Omega, turn off the TV. Engaging wave cannon. Oh wow! And the death. Omega by Square Enix. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Very well. That was dark. Very well. <laughs> Wait, th was this an official? They, they yeah. made this? Yeah, they made that. I mean, they make Square some weird that. stuff. There's some weird stuff on this YouTube. What the shit? Truly really bizarre. That wasn't like the winner of some fan contest. Actually, was it? I mean, it might be like one of those, like sending a sending a video kind of things. Don't show me the Endwalker trailer. God damn it. Oh, did you start it auto playing? Yeah, I, I went back to the the, uh, the, oh, the, the homepage okay. for yeah. the channel and it's just like Endwalker trail. I'm like, go away. Not today, Satan. You've seen the the like the anime one, right? The anime commercial. No. Oh, right, OK. While, while we're sitting here watching things on a one, two, three, let's watch that together. OK. Right, I, I just want it. you to see it because I love it so much. What? Just send me a link. Yeah, I got you. What? I just think this thing is so adorable. Okay. Yep. 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 All right. Uh, all right. 30 seconds. Let's get volume. I, uh, there's no ad. Are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> oh my god, this is so charming. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh shit, yeah. Yeah. Dude, that's an ad. That's amazing. <laughs> that's cool as shit. That one's great. I love that's it. It's just good. Yeah. It's super just good. What, what studio did that? It's beautiful. That's super cute. That's really cool. I like that a lot. That's rad, man. Thank you for uh, sharing that with me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I with that, something. Our, uh, our night comes to an end. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, um, we post a new podcast today. Grinding Gear Podcast is going uh, where we talk about uh, we, we get to explore all of the things we start to get off on tangents about on the stream. So today we talked about uh, some pretty hilarious Blizzard stuff. Um, we launched a new segment called Cringeworthy, where I learn if Kyle's a total cringe monster or not. It was great. Uh, I came out completely unscathed. Just so you know. Um, but yeah, go find the Grinding Gear podcast wherever podcasts can be found. Uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done it already. And uh, go watch our video that went up on Thursday, or no, Wednesday this week. Yeah. Brand new video out right here on the channel. Watch it if you haven't already. So, Bots oh, going and up. our Patreon. Our Patreon is up now. Go to supportourbromance.com. Check it out. Oh, those bots are having at it. Yeah, they're, they're going wild. They're oh, it's like they know when we're I know. Going they always come in right like, at the hey, end. You thirsty? Yes, you thirsty after watching these, they're two, heading these out, two hunk of men? But it goes all night yeah. over at whatever adult web, whatever here. Oh, that didn't work at all. What happened there? I, I that, don't know. That, that link broke. I think I clicked a button while I posted it. Oh, no. It like highlighted the grinding gear as though it was talking to us. Yeah, that's all that happened. Oh, it did that the last time you posted okay. it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's weird. All right. You all have a lovely night. Subscribe. Like the stream. It all helps out. Appreciate y'all. Thank you for all the super chats tonight as well. And uh, bye now. That was fantastic. GG.